Why don't you, you ever come close to me? What's going on here? I have been ignoring you because I know an empty bar can never stand upright. But you have overstepped your boundaries. Please. E -E -E Joma, Th that is a very, a very sensitive spot. C -c can you please put down the knife? Will you shut up? Please. Can we just resolve this amicably? You will kill him, oh, please. He who plays with fire should be ready to be burnt. I cannot ask God to help me over someone I know I can comfortably kill. Tobin. The gentleness of a tiger is never a sign of cowardice or timidity. You have done enough. Don't you dare come closer. Because if you try any rubbish, I shall slit his throat right now. No, Don't dare me. Please, please. What was going on here today? Ah! What is ah! It's only a fool. That touches the lion still and expects no reaction. Tobina, I can take anything from you. But the next time your hand touches my mother or your breeze, that day will be your end. Do you hear me? This is war. You have officially called for war. Get ready. Nonsense. Hey! Right! You! You! Hey! What I want to hear? She just live with them. Remember, say every man. Ah, see blood. To me, so everybody gets in own darkness. To me, so why you dey show yourself? I bring me go round for you. So why you dey show? Ichioko, how is everything? Everything is fine. <laughs> I'm a non-quadula quadu because I am prepared. Are you quadula? We are fully prepared as well. <laughs> don't get over because we are here. Ego ili Ego no. No way la da. Ego ili ili. How for kabulu? Ego ili ili. My plan minister. Um. So sorry for keeping you all waiting. I was in a an important call with the essay to the governor. Oh, you are welcome. Don't miss. Don't miss. Uh, uh, without wasting much time, the future of this kingdom is ours to protect, and that is the sole reason we are here. Of course. An elder does not sit at home and watch the gods deliver in Tita. I understand perfectly what that means. Eh? So, what is the plan? Ah, uh, would you just shut up? You are only here to observe and speak when you're asked to. You're not fit for this gathering, so keep quiet. Who are you? Listen to me. When a small child decides to wash his legs in the liver, eh? That liver will swallow that child without uh, uh, neglecting it. I'm going to go to the And I presume you're the supposed river. Agu, what really do you think you can do with your worthless money? Enough! Isn't it what you're not? As long as he's not against our motives, he's welcome to say whatever he feels that will be of help. This is no time for confrontation at all. We, 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 no one should leave an object and run after its shadow. It is not done. We have an agenda. And that agenda is what should be bothering us now. 
We have an agenda for today. And that is why we are here. Sure. No other thing. Um, it won't be easy to convince the king that none of his sons is fit to rule this kingdom. We are... We have a duty to inform him that the kingship must have to rotate. Uh, uh, my Prime Minister, with due respect, you know me to be a man of truth and honesty. Adam may fail now. He is not blind. He knows that his children are lascars and vagabonds and that they are not fit to be king. Agu. It will never happen. Not when me, Agu, is still in this kingdom. Oh, 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 me. Agu, can you just shut up for once? We haven't started looking for guards. When we do, you'll be given room to speak. Until then, keep quiet. And who are you? You are talking to me like, who are you? Are, are you that crass res that you can't respect the Prime Minister of Omo Nono? You are the classless fool who isn't just stupid, but absolutely reprehensible. Why are you talking about shut up? Quiet! One more word from both of you. You will leave this room. We should concern ourselves with the issue at hand. This is no shite's play. Your Majesty, today is a K market day, a very sacred day in Umunono Kingdom. We see this topic as a very sacred one, and that is where we are presenting it on a K market day. A sacred topic to be presented on a K market day. I can understand. Because when the moon is shining, even the cripple becomes hungry for a walk. But we are lucky that we live in a kingdom called Omunono. A kingdom with a glorious history, well-documented history. We have laws in this land. Have we forgotten? Your Highness, we all know that. But you know we have a point. A good point. I can, I can see your point. Nobody is, is saying that you don't have a point. But let me tell you something, my Prime Minister. Kingship may rotate in all other kingdoms, but it cannot rotate here in Omunono. I, as I was the 15th, the great grandson of Osakwe, that warrior who terminated that demon, will never allow what you are suggesting to see the light of day. My king. We are talking about the future of our land here. Yes, my king. That is what is obtainable in all places. Rotational kingship gives people a sense of belonging. And we may add, your highness, that we have discussed extensively with many people in Omonono and in support of what we demand. And I will personally add, your majesty, though it might be unofficial, but what we conducted could be referred to as a referendum. Yes. And the entire people of Umunono Kingdom have unanimously said yes. So we have no option than to do that which is right. That which has become the norm everywhere. Hey, listen to me. This is your code. What you are saying may be the norm everywhere. In fact, it may actually be the norm all over the world. But we are in Umunono. But I want to make something very clear. It is not going to happen here in Umunono. Because we have a history, a very peculiar history here. And that history is very peculiar to our hearts. Now. Oh yeah. <laughs> you you. Okay. I'm surprised at myself. Based on what happened yesterday, I shouldn't be playing with you girls. I should be talking to the elders. What do you mean by that? I had a terrible dream last night. And when I woke up, I was not myself. What was the dream all about? I saw death. 
in every family in this village. What kind of dream was that? I don't know. That's why I said that I don't I shouldn't be playing today. and allow death sweep all of us out. Our family and loved ones are dying every day. We have to do something, Diopa. We have to. <gasps> it's okay, Kiki. I am helpless. This thing is beyond me. Our faith must be strong. Let's believe that the gods will come very soon and save us. Uh, 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 Diopa, Diopa, please. <laughs> very soon? For, for, for how long are we going to wait? Uh, uh, I am suggesting that we should go and consult Ichiyo Sakwe the Diviner. Prince Oku is not giving us any solution. It's okay, okay. Yeah, Diopa. Oku is the only diviner we must seek in this land. You are a respected Iche in this land. And you must not encourage anybody to do anything else. Uh, uh, um... Well, well um, you have you, you have said it. No, no, no problem. But I was thinking we no problem. Calamity has befallen us. What happened? Following the death of the maidens yesterday, we lost. Four young men this morning. What? Diokban, we are doomed. As men saddled with the leadership responsibility of Omonono, we must do something and do it fast before we sleep and the next morning no one wakes up. May the cause forbid. And what are you doing here? Leave here, you are not needed here. When the gods want to kill a man, they first of all make him mad. What? The Okma, who made the Nobi of Umunono. Your madness is incurable. Osakwe, leave my presence now before your corpse is carried out. I am not afraid of death. I have not committed any evil. Your abomination brought the wrath of the gods to the land. And to avert the wrath of the gods, this land needs to be cleansed with your blood. Osakwe, I am Ume Dinobi, the dead cat that pulls the mighty to the early grave. I am the untouchable of Emunono, the indestructible, absolutely. I am that fearless spirit, even the evil spirit, dread. Osakwe, leave here now, or you will be dead. I told you I'm not afraid of death. I've committed no wrong. My blood will not be used to cleanse the land. You are the one that committed abomination that brought problems to this land. This land needs to be cleansed with your blood. Who is going to make that happen? You? Time will tell. Osakwe? It's okay, okay. Yes, uh, Umed Nobi. You are the reason he's still alive. Uh, uh, yes, I know. Obwe enough lions. I advise him. Yes. I am the only sea of this land. I know. And nobody challenges me. No, no, nobody. No, who will challenge you? Nobody. Advise him. Yes. In fact, because of this now, I will go straight to his house and talk to him. I will talk to him myself. Osakwe? Diokpa, who made the nobi, 
killed his wife and wiped out the memory of the daughter with one of his charms and brought her back to this land and called her his wife. And that abomination is what is killing us in Umunono till today. Um, who are you referring to? Is it the beautiful maiden he brought back from Akabwe as his wife? She was originally his daughter, given to him by the woman he lived with in Akabwe. Wait, 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 hold it. This whole thing is complicated. Are you saying our community leader, the wife he is living with, is his daughter? Exactly. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Yay! Exactly. She was originally his daughter. He brought her back here and called her his wife. These and many more abominable acts committed by Omedinobi is why we are in this mess today. <laughs> we are finished. What do we do? That innocent woman he killed demands his blood. He had to sacrifice his blood, and that is the only way and nothing else. Diokma is very powerful. Even the spirit dreads him. How in this world do we get him to offer himself? <laughs> In this land, where I rule as the Oishi, you can't go against me. What's that way? I've told you times with that number, I am not afraid of death. I am Osakwe, the fearless warrior. I've fought and defeated many evil spirits. I'm your end. What's that way? I can see you want me to kill you the hard way. Osakwe! Osakwe! It has never been reported on Umu Nono that the ancestors sent a man on an errand and abandoned him. Please don't abandon me. I'm doing this for the future of Umu Nono. You and those your ancestors, I'll kill all of you. I'll kill you. How dare you conspire against me? Uh, please, Oyisi, please don't spare my life, Oyisi. See, uh, I, I was telling each your Osakwe. Uh, no, no. Shut up! I know the conspiracy. Hey. No, 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 no. There is no, there is no conspiracy. I, how can I conspire against you now? Please, Oyisi, please. I don't want me. to hear anything from you. By the time I finish with all of you, if you hear my name next time, you go deaf and dumb. Yes, yes, I know. Please, well, I mean, uh, there will be no need for that. We made you be. Today is your end. Because you survived the first, you think you can survive the second? Right in my compound. Oh, Sakwe! One is gone. Yes, yes, he's gone. gone. He's gone. In your wisdom, you came to the central deity of Omonono and lifted the ancient sword. You finally use it to secure the freedom of the land. By the verdict, 
of the ancestors, you will become the king of Omonona people. I give you this. And from today, this will be given to all the kings that will rule Omonon as symbol of strength and authority. Your reign is blessed with showers of rain, and so shall it be. By every standard, this is a glorious history rooted into the hearts of all the well-meaning members of this community. Is it not? Go ahead. Or somewhere. Took the bull by the horn, risked his own life, and destroyed that demon. By so doing, he emerged the very first king of whom none are kingdom. So what are we saying? Kingship must remain in this family as a mark of respect to that of Sapo. This is how it must be and there is nothing anybody can do about this. Whatever you call your name, this music that you're dancing to, we only need your discussion to be now. Face me, man, to man, and put down this gun. I will marry for the bull out war, Omaze will let Kenko. If a scorpion does not stink, a fool will pick it up and throw it to the fire. Tobenna, redress your step or you face me man to man, Tobenna. Okay, okay. Finish him. Stop your face me man to man. Finish him. Finish him. I am tired of you and your useless sisters. So one more word from you and I will blow your skull. Nam, shoot their skull Finish them. Kill them. Pull the trigger if you have the strength. Pull. Tobinna, please, this is a gun you're holding. No, I won't. Let me place them where they belong. One more word. No, no, no. Kill him. 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 You see what we have been saying, Igwe? Bring it down, Tobinna. Tobinna, lower that gun. Bring that gun down immediately. Listen to your father, Tobinna. We invited you. We invited you. Finish that! Patro, 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 patro. Kill all of them. Except his father. Good. Thank Please. your stars that father is here. Thank you. But next time you might not be this lucky. Enugugu, Enugugu, Abrof. That's my brother. To be the my second and his father. Hey, hey, stop. Follow them. What is because of you? Join them. What is because of you? Please, useless, useless girl. Can someone explain to me what is going on? Does it mean I cannot have just 30 minutes of peace in this palace? Who did I offend? Who did I offend? I'm asking all of you. Father, the problem is simple. Your refusal to tell these people that they are not royalty is the problem here. Will you shut up? Tell them where they belong. Will you shut up? They are my children. Just like you and your sisters. How many times will I tell you that? Father, let us call a spade a spade. It is high time you told this people where they truly belong because we are not equal. Exactly, Father. We are not equal in any way at all. They are supposed to be dragging things with us in this family. Father, they are meant to be second option. No, 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 listen, listen, all of you. Huh. I want to end this here and now. All my children are equal. They are equal in everything. They have equal rights. They have equal privileges. And I want to issue an order right here, right now, that on no account whatsoever will anybody Deny any of my children anything. Omame. Oh, yes, Omame, oh, Father. This your order will not stand. You need to make these people understand that we are first class citizens of this palace. 
while they are still looking for resident permits. Ndari Daduro, they are not our member. They don't have royal blood. Yes. Is it not about wearing royal costume? No. They are not royalty. Let's call it spade a spade. Tobenna. Tobenne. At least for once, learn how to respect your father. No, not when my hey, father hey, is hey, talking nonsense. Tobenna, Tobenna, listen, listen to me. Tobenna, I, I, I am warning you. Be very careful. Be mindful of the kind of things you say to me. I know why I am still tolerating you. Tobenna, be very careful before my leniency evaporates. You will not like how I'm going to handle you. Father, thanks goodness that you can see things for yourself. Yes. Afraid, will you shut up? We don't talk unless you are asked to. Shut up! Father, you are the problem here. Tell these people that they are not royalty. Shut up with that, my sister. What's your problem? Behave yourself. You, you, you know what? You see that gun you are carrying around? Right here, right now, I am ordering you to bring it out. Put it on this table. Man, right. I will not on no account. Father, why am I even speaking English? You are yelling about a popsy. You are You talking to me? Yes, you are yelling rubbish. Why will I drop my gun when the palace is not safe? My gun is for safety in case of riot or anything. You are yearning up at all. In a court, you are the Johnson father. What? What? What are you? What are you saying? Why am I even beginning this? Pops is the Jones. What? What are you saying? Pops is you the. I'm so glad that I'm not going to spoil you. Pops is you the Jones. If not the Jones, the reason to not say they don't belong here. How far now? Say my sorry, not my God. It was a riot. What sort of nonsense is that? You are the problem here. Tell these people that they are not royalty. They don't have royal blood in them. Let's call it spade a spade. You the Jones. In a court matter. As for you people, you are. Bye, bye, bye. It is okay. Take it easy, eh? And you will still look at me. You will still look me in the eyes and tell me that that animal who just left here now is my son? Ah, Your Highness, why are you sounding like this now? All made me proud today. <laughs> Mother, mm. they haven't seen anything yet. You see, by the time we have finished dealing with all of them in this palace, eh? Sir? Palace. They will have no choice than to run out empty handed. Empty, Mother. Me, I am allergic to peace. I know, brother. <laughs> At the end, I must make sure Father regrets marrying a second wife. That's the spirit. Who Zodema and her children will see something mightier than peace in this palace? <laughs> they don't even know what is coming their way. They do not know that we are the real definition of trouble. Problem, Mama. Problem! We will give it to them. Mother, you have to warn that man that calls himself your husband. Today should be the very last time he will ask me to drop my staff of authority. That staff of authority is my personal property. For that reason, on no account should I drop it for someone else. I can My son, I'll talk to you. Big brother, you have my full support. You know, these people should be taught a big lesson in this palace. It's getting too much of them. Ah, these people, we will give them problem. We will give them trouble and they will run. Exactly. They will fizzle away, baby. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. See, my children, we have to do everything possible to avoid these people. It is already obvious they are classless, and we cannot reduce ourselves to their level. Never, mother. Never. This whole madness has got to stop. I mean, they cannot treat us like slaves in our father's house. It is never done. Never. Ijoma, violence can never solve this. We need to show them love. Mm. It's only love that can change them. No, no. Ujoka, Ijoma is right. She's very right. Yes. If they want war, I shall give them war. Yes. However they want it, I shall give them back to back. If they breed violence, then violence they shall receive. Ijoma, 
Why can't you listen to your family members? And understand there is always an end to everything. The onus of ending this whole madness rests on them. They were the ones that started first, and they have to stop. If they don't, mother, I will never, never. Exactly my sentiment. They need to stop and accept us, not just as family, but equals in our standard. Yes. Ijoman, there is this saying. Two wrongs can never make a right. Exactly. Will you claim that you've never heard that? I have heard that, my brother. But they should first of all accept that they are wrong. And then, we shall trace where to commence the process of being right. Carried your back from God knows where to another woman's house. You think there will be no consequences? My queen, for how long are we going to continue like this? Oh, I thought you've gotten used to it. So why are you asking me to speak to my children? No same person gets used to violence. For violence is for crazy minds. Wait a minute. Are you indirectly calling me a crazy woman? You are shouting, my queen. It has not got into that. Shout. Really? You said I'm shouting. You think you're civil, right? Now wait. We shall see. We shall see! My queen, I don't mean it that way. That's not what I mean. I called all of us out here because we cannot be in the river, yet allow soap to blind our eyes. Your proverb is confusing. Who is the river? Who is the soap and whose eyes are they entering? What is it this time? We all know that father would want Prince Udoka to succeed him, right? And that is going to be very disastrous. Over my dead body will that happen? That will never happen, else blood will flow. See, we need to plan on how to eliminate Udoka as a possible candidate for that throne. Serious plan, you know. <laughs> Mother, what is it? There is no network on your face. Can you imagine? That woman your father brought into this palace looked at me and said I'm crazy. She didn't even end there. She went ahead to say that I'm insane! Me! What? Hey, has she suddenly forgotten her position in this palace? Or does she need someone to remind her? Don't worry, mother. Let me handle her. No, no, no. Don't bother yourself. Let me handle her. You people should just focus on those things she called children. Those watching. I will handle her myself. Mama, let Allow me to handle, handle her. Please let us handle these people. Let us handle her, please. Ah, let us handle them. Calm down. I will not treat anybody disrespecting my mother. Will you sit before me and claim you have not heard this ancient proverb for our people? When the mother goat is eating the deadly grass, the young ones are looking at her. How can your children show signs of peace in this palace, one part of you? Their mothers are always fighting. How is that possible? My king, 
You know all I want is peace. But we know the man won't let it be. Can you imagine she called me a crazy woman? My husband, please, I never planned for all this to happen. I promise to make sure we live in peace. My king, all I want is peace. Just because I asked her to speak to her children, she called me all sorts of names. How can I achieve that? By her ignoring my efforts. That's How can? A lie. That's a lie. She is lying. Hey, hey, hey. Shut up, both of you. I don't want to hear this again. I have had enough. And I want you to understand something. That today is going to be the last day this will happen in this palace. If what happened here today it repeats itself again, I swear on the grave of my father that I'm going to send both of you out of this palace. And I mean every word of that. My king, I promise it will never happen again. I will do everything humanly possible to make sure that I put this household in peace. Please, I'm sorry. My husband, please forgive us. It will not happen again. We will do better. So when are you coming to the palace? Very soon. Very, very soon, my love. And speaking of the palace, how is the king and everyone else doing? They're all doing great. Hmm. And your siblings? I hope they no longer trouble you. My siblings are always troublesome. But I know how to handle troublesome people. Or don't you trust me? Of course I do, baby. But then you've got to be careful. I mean, you know your brother will succeed the king. You have to be diligent with your actions. That way he doesn't send you out of the palace when he becomes the king. Over my dead body will that happen. He will never become the king. I will succeed my father. Come on, my love. You know that is not possible. We already have a known procedure in this land. And I, Tobenna, the man of war, I'm not wired into that useless procedure. I have a plan. You do? Yes, I do. Please, tell me about it. I mean, you know I love you so much and I would always want to see you succeed. I want us to work together. Ah, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Welcome, Dad. The Prince of Munan himself. I wonder why you are doing hide and seek with my daughter. I am not doing hide and seek with your daughter. Then, when are you bringing cola and drinks to my people? You are not saying anything. I will do that when the time is right. much father but I figured he doesn't get along with his brother and he's ready to do anything to take out his brother that's great <sighs> we can only penetrate them when there's this unity and desperation I think we can work with that now but how good the only problem we have there is Udoka if we can take Udoka out of the way by the help of Tobena, we have won. But then, if Udoka is out, Tobena will succeed the king. Not even the king will allow a creature like Tobena to rule this law. Never. The only problem we have is Udoka. 
Moreover, it will be easy to make Tobema unfit for the throne. Can't you see that? <laughs> Father, a wise man. Good. Concentrate on making sure that Udoka is out of the way. Yes, Father. That's my target. That's my girl. Afternoon, Brown King here. How are you? I'm fine, my friends. Good. Wow. You are such an epitome of beauty. I can't wait to take you out someday. You know, you are such an epitome of beauty. I wonder what you're doing with my brother. Don't you know he's a weak king? A real queen like you deserves a real king. What do you think? I hope I didn't keep you for long. No, my love. Please, can we go inside now? Are you okay? It's fine. Did he say or do anything to you? What sort of stupid question is that? Even if I did, will you challenge the man of war? My love, please, don't do this. Let's go inside. I know you're a weakling, but I never knew you were a womanizer. Listen to me to me now. For your own good, stay out of my way. Before I will do something that I will regret. And what will that be? Now you listen and listen real good. The vulture and the kite do not scramble for food. Yes. Because the vulture is a scavenger, while the kite is a predator. Dear the man of war, and I will feed your bones to the dogs. Enuguku, Enugumbo, Abrofu. Empty drums, they say, make the loudest noise. I am not scared of what you are going to do because you are always a noise maker. So, enjoy your noise. Let's go. She na you invent the formula we make everybody the grace. She na you design the strategy we make everybody the mad. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting on madness. So I. So why you they show yourself? Oh. Have you been good for yeah. you? So why you they show yourself? How often do you go through such terror? Oh, don't bother yourself about my brother. It's nothing. No. Hey. There is more to what I just witnessed. Are you guys dragging anything? Nothing that I know of. You have to learn to avoid his struggles. He's a violent person to have called himself a man of war. He needs your prayers and love. <laughs> <laughs> I may be the peacemaker, sharer of Come love. Come on, babe. I'll, I've heard you. I'm okay. not joking with all this. I, I was just joking with you. Come on. Hmm? I mean, um, tell me what do you want to take and how we order it for you. And to be here in 20 minutes. I hope you don't mind. Suggest anything for me. Know your category. Eh? What is this supposed to mean? Please just sit down. Is it commanding us to sit down? Like when did that one start? Hey, Olga. Okay. Listen, guys. I called this meeting because 
we are one family. Same blood. I want us to come together because together we will be unbreakable. Wonders shall never end. Like seriously? Slave, they call King's meeting. We call this meeting as who? See, say you wear royal clothes, don't mean say you don't be royal to you. We still they manage you. How can I go call men out? Come the hand of battle. Your brain depend you. Don't try this nonsense again, no more. Yeah. No try and maintain, no matter what depends you. Wonders shall never end. You call me. Yeah. He called us here for peace. At least let's all give him a listening ear. My friend, will you shut up? Shut up. You don't speak unless you are asked to. DNA test is needed as a because I'm not sure you're my blood. Did I tell you I want peace? Have you forgotten my name? I am the man of war. I don't send peace. Besides, this refrain has no right to call everybody out. Can you imagine? As who, Guano? No, as who? All oh, man within Kato. Day your day, make I day my day. Add me if a family meeting. Do you understand? How one are you go call men out? Come there, no matter. The next time you try this nonsense, a Bobby, I go show you say, Enugu bu, Enugu bu, abrofu. To benna, to benne. You know say you two they carry talk. You just two they carry talk anyhow. No be you invent formula for madness. You know hard all of us to follow you off clothes, but the thing be say. Whether you go fit trek the trek with us, Tobena, be very, very careful with me. Wow. Doing is the cry for help. I don't blame you now. No, I don't blame you. Men don't they put you for car, they lodge you for hotel, they give you small, small money for your mind now you don't arrive. I mean, they fellow talk. If you don't take time, if you don't take time, I go to forbid you. <laughs> Picking well no no weed. And then they call them vegetable. You see this toilet where you they smoke? You don't they worry you for medulo blancata. So make I tell you, eh? No matter how many times when you off clothes for markets, you know affect buying and selling. You know? Markets go still the same. Even if you like, come out your clothes, go naked, go around the market, you no go ever stop buying and selling. Markets go the same. You know what they tell you, Tobena? Tobena, be careful of me. You know if you do me anything, no matter how you try, you know fit. Oh, she. Badass. Motivational speaker. I mean, they perform for. You don't turn motivational speaker now. They are not bad. You just open mouth. Brah! Yaga, 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 yo. If I receive you. You know fit, Tobena. If you think you can actually do anything to me, I am talking to you. Go ahead and do it already. Oh, come on, Ijama, shut up. And how dare you to tell me to shut up? Who the hell do you think you are? I never get your time, a woman, you be. You see, I bother not mm. because very soon you will chew back your word. Exactly. Very soon we will know who is who around you. Can we just calm down? Oh, shut up. Please, let's calm down. What is going on? I call this meeting and you people have not even given me the least one minute to just air my point and everybody's shouting. What is going on? What? They are jealous because they know you will rule over them soon. Yeah? In Omnajaka. In Omnajaka. Jealous of who? No, jealous of who now? Who told you that slaves are permitted to talk when they are not asked to? One more word from you and I will just figure your face. Listen and listen real good. I demand me for family meeting. Are you listening? How can I go fall men out? You call me in as who? What did they give you that money? You call me in as who now? Day your day, make I day my day. Every man I would think. The next time you try this nonsense, eh? Maba, I will repent you. Mwagi ne nugu ku ne nugu ngwa aburofu. Manolese ape. 
Come on. Down. Hey, don't. You know it. Yes, Tobena. If you want to pass, then get off my face. You, you don't have to push me. You said? You don't have to push me. You said? You said you don't have to push me. You said? You can't push me. Bye, Awa. I am unmovable. Your mother, the fridge. Away. Get out. Your mother, the fridge. Get out. Your own day for cold room. Thank you guys for wasting my time. And let this be the last time you, you, what they even call you, you, will call us for meeting again. Don't try it again. Fool. Go, carry on. To the fence. You see? You see? These are the people you believe will ever change in this life. But I don't know what else I can do. I don't know. There is nothing else for you to do. It's just to give them tic tac. However they want it. Fire for fire. Back to back. However they want it. I'm ever ready for them. Oh please. Oh, this is not what we represent. It is high time. It is high time. Please. Rubbish. However they want it. I am very much ready for them. What madness. Elders, from the look of things, the king is not going to give in to our request. And that's a very big problem. We are not expecting him to give in easily to our request. We have to do everything to get that throne out of that household. Uh, uh, let me ask, why must we delve into such matters? We are not in a position to decide who becomes the king. Oh yes, King Osakwe the 15th did not do anything to deserve such conspiracy. That is my stand. Are you saying that you are not aware of the riot going on in that family? Riot or no riot, it is natural. Every family disagrees to agree once in a while. It is natural, like I said. So, uh, nothing is out of place in that family as far as I'm concerned. Ijioko. Yes. Are you saying that it's natural for a young man to be carrying on about smoking all manner of banned substances, endangering the lives of others? But, but, but that's such his life. It is obvious that Jifoko is coming from space. <laughs> he doesn't know what actually is going on. Well, we have to join hands together and make it work. Hmm? We have to find a way to make this kinship rotate to a decent family. And we all must join hands together to make this work. Good afternoon, distinguished chiefs of Umunono. Good afternoon. You're welcome. How thank you? you. I'm fine, thank you. Um, we have to adjourn this meeting. Why? How? What? 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 You heard me. We have to adjourn this meeting. Seat. So, why were they here? They were here for you. Yes. Baby, I meant it when I said I'll help you. You see, I spoke to my father about you and he decided to call for a meeting. Yeah. They were actually discussing who will become the next king. Wow, that's thoughtful of you. But what if they find nothing wrong uh, in him becoming king? Not to worry, baby. Leave that with me. As a matter of fact, we can actually make Udo count fit for the throne. I don't think that will be possible. Udoka is too clean to have a stay. Leave it with me. 
Yes. Meanwhile, tell me what's been going on in the palace. Udoka wants peace, but I walked out on him. I felt, I felt him though. Baby, are you going to allow the same people who stole your father's position, his money, and his love to be the same ones to send you out of the palace? That's what my mother usually says. Then you must not slack with these people. Else you wake up one day and realize that they've taken away everything from you. Over my dead body will that happen? Then we must take Prince Udoka out of the way. When are you invent the formulas? We make everybody the grace. When are you design the strategy? We make everybody the mad. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody gets I you swear to me off my feet. <laughs> You know, you came into my life, you wiped all my tears away, and you gave me an air, and finally, you made my joy to be complete. <laughs> I am happy I did that for you, my husband. <laughs> you see, each time I look at you, I will see the reason. In fact, I will realize that indeed, I am a very blessed man. <laughs> what a stupid story. Yes. So she has been the one brainwashing you into thinking my siblings and I are worthless. I am disappointed in you. You feel blessed because she gave you an air. Hey, Duman, please. You must have to be very careful how you are twisting what I said. That's not what I meant. Tobinna, you misunderstood your father. Will you shut up, you sack of mess. Women don't talk when men are talking. What? What's your problem? Even if you fool everybody, you can't fool me. I am a man of war. Yes. Hey, listen to me. Be very careful. Be very careful the kind of words you utter before me. No, who are you? Do you want to you want to ignite my rot? How dare you speak? To my wife in that language. And you are standing before me calling yourself man of war? What will you do? Yes, what will you do? Will you fight me? No, tell me else what? Let's call a spare a spare. She's the problem. Get out of this place. You're very stupid and annoying. You're the problem here. You are the problem here. Do not force me to kill you. To be like, no, no, my husband. Are you out of your mind? You stand before me to call yourself a man of war. Are you crazy or something? My husband, please. Okay. I beg you. Let this be the very last time you will ever lift your head against my wife. Try this again, and you are a dead man. Get out. Get out! I got this here. I got this here. I got this here. I have with you. Nonsense. My husband, please calm down. <laughs> my pity. My pity. Prince Tobina pushed the Queen Mother to the floor. Tobina pushed my mom to the floor? No, not your mom, Miss Princess. It's your mom's mom. What? Tobina did what? Pushed the Queen Mother to the floor. For you to prove if you're a real man or a weakling, like they call you. And what's that supposed to mean? Prince Tobina pushed mother down. Which mother? Wait, our mother? Yes. Stop now. What is the problem? What happened? Why are you like this? What Don't you, you ever come close to me. What's going on here? I have been ignoring you because I know an empty bar can never stand upright. But you have overstepped your boundaries. Please. E -E -E Joma, that, that is a very, a very sensitive spot. C -c can you please put down the knife? Will you shut up? Please. Can we just resolve this amicably? You will kill him, oh, please. 
He who plays with fire should be ready to be burnt. I cannot ask God to help me over someone I know I can comfortably kill. To be now. The gentleness of a tiger is never a sign of cowardice or timidity. You have done enough. Don't you dare come closer. Because if you try any rubbish, I shall slit his throat right now. Don't dare me. Please, please. What was going on here today? Ah! What is that? It's only a fool that touches the lion still and expects no reaction. Tobina, I can take anything from you. But the next time your hand touches my mother or your breeze, that day will be your end. Do you hear me? This is war. You have officially called for war. Get ready. Nonsense. Hey! Run! You! When you hide! Let! What just happened here? Did she just live with them? Remember, say every man I'm getting there. Ah, say blood! Tomina! So everybody gets in own madness. Tomina! So why you they show yourself? I'll bring me go wrong for you. So why you they show yourself? Listen to me attentively. Smooth up letters. Leave no places. And that is why they are called smooth up letters. We know who you are, boss. And we know how thorough you can be when it comes to setting targets and getting results. Why then are we discussing this? Anybody who looks at you people will not suspect that you are capable of doing anything that is deadly. Some people might even think that you are virgins. Hmm? That's a very, uh, what do I call it? A deceitful, that is very deceitful. So I want you to use that cover to work for me and deliver on this assignment. Hmm? I cannot swear for Annabelle, but I can swear for myself. I will never disappoint you. And I equally can swear for myself. I will never let you down. I am very happy to hear that. In a nutshell, I want you to get lead of Ezinne and her father, the Prime Minister. If you can achieve that for me, I will transport you to Canada and get you established there. I personally do not have problem with Ezine. She can be destroyed with ease. Uh, what then are you waiting for? Destroy her already. Oh, God, wrong. Her father, the Prime Minister, is the problem. He's a man of ancient powers. Can we destroy a man like that? I haven't heard the king is afraid of him. I just want both of you to shut up. Shut up. Don't provoke me. Perhaps, maybe you don't know where you are coming from. You are a mafia. And the mafia all over the world is known to be very lootless. Lootless. Rather than to a they can go to the exclave. level. So well, you shouldn't be scared of ancient powers. The type the Prime Minister uses. Eh? You are above that. I want you to conquer fear and do this work. You must not fail on this assignment. I know you're wondering why I'm here. The visit of a masquerade is never without messages from the gods. You can only run around a pepper tree. You can never climb it. You don't swim in a shallow water if you don't want your back to show. Hmm. Only a fool dwells where spirits fear. Hmm. 
Can you withstand the venom of a viper? There is nothing the venom of a viper can do to the shell of a tortoise. Hmm. I presume you see yourself as the almighty tortoise. I don't have time for that. Algo, I am here to warn you. Let this be the last time you ever try digging dirt on my father and I again. The next time you do that, you will be digging your own grave. And I won't hesitate to bury you. Oh, my child, no, shut up. Shut up. You're, you're just pouring saliva on me. Get in the middle. Shut up. Who are you? Hmm. Spoiled child of a body in this load. No, no, no. He follows up. Huh? Those who are down do not fear falling. I will, I will not warn you again. Listen, listen to me. One day, something will happen to you, but it's not going to be in my house. He ne gumiri, he ne guaku, he guaku olewa ya anya no no. Agu, I will not warn you again. You are playing with fire, and it will come. Hey, shut you. up! Get out! Get nevegi. I'm not gonna see you. Get out of my sight. Just go and remove your salad clay pad. Eh? You come back and we talk. I have warned you. Try me. I'm a child and get out. Go, go away. Go and, go and, go and remove your sanitary pad. Eh? Don't go to one here. Uh -uh. Why? Because we do not want a rat in our midst. See? Stop calling me a rat. Because I am not a rat. You are not a rat. Fine. Cut. Leave. Leave before I smash your head on the wall. Leave! Leave now! to eliminate Prince Udoka so that he does not become a threat to you is by framing him up. What kind of frame up will be effective? We all know that a rapist cannot be a king in this kingdom. And that man, when so accused, he will be cooling his head for years in the prison. That's a smart one. I like the idea. Wonderful idea. But we all know that Prince Udoka cannot rape anyone. So how do we achieve that? Who says he has to do it? So how then do we frame him up? Ah. Mm -hmm. I see. That's what's up. I see. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> That's what's up, bro. Who then can we use to achieve that? His girlfriend, of course. What? His what? Girlfriend. Afoma. That girl, please, that girl will never agree to such. Let's just look for someone else. Please. The Udoka that we all know will never ever allow himself be in a confined place with another woman. You know that, yeah? We must find a way out. This is a very brilliant plan. But please, we can't afford to mess it up. Using our former, that girl, is one way to just mess all this up. So who then do we use? Good idea is one thing. Good execution is another thing. Let's execute this appropriately. It's okay. one of the private palaces we have in this palace. They have the right to be here. Why are you planning to bar them? Did you say bar them? We are not just planning to bar them. They are already bad. And it stands. Do you understand? Bad by whose order? Is father aware of this? It will be each time I try so hard to hold myself from slapping you. You push me even further and make me want to slap your tits off. Does it mean that you will never grow up? I tell you, 
I am sorry, but you are not making sense. <gasps> Father will not approve this. That should not be any of your headache. Look, there is a war going on in this palace. It is a war of supremacy and power. Key into that war and bond properly with your family. And stop being stupid. They are my family too. Ijama will soon be here. If you try to stop her, she will fight you. And you know how she fights. Hey, Ijoma is going to be here. Please, Madame Ebube, what will your Ijoma do? Do you think Ijoma can beat us? No, leave us. Me! You think she can beat me? Ijoma, may she try her now. May she try her. See this girl, no. You want to kill my daughter? It's only an animal that can do this to someone. What is this? Udoka, let me tell you something. No, 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 A bird that perches on a rope will never have rest because the rope will keep dangling, likewise the bird. As long as you and your useless siblings have decided to be dragging things with us in this palace, you people will never have peace. He say, an old woman that doesn't run must run when the goat picks on her snuff case. Tobena, I also want peace. But I will sit and fold my hands and watch you carry me on your head. Never. That my child is tall doesn't mean he is now a full grown man. Are you sure you can stand this war? When a woman is running and holding her breast, she's not afraid that the breast will fall off. She's just protecting her dignity and her respect. Dobena, you cannot do anything. All right. I am not just mad like you. Doka, I am tired of exchanging words with you because we are not on the same frequency, neither are you on my category. Get out of my presence, else I will do something that you will regret for the rest of your life. Now leave. Let the kites perch and let the eagle perch also. But if one says no to the other, let its wind break. You cannot chase me out of my father's house. Get out! Get out of here! Get out of here! Enough! Enough of this madness! Enough! 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 Look at what they did to my daughter. Shut up! Listen, I have had enough of this nonsense. Behave yourselves. This place is a palace. Not a marketplace. Behave yourselves. Look at what they did to my daughter. Yeah, 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 come back. Come back, stand here. Jenna, you design the strategy. We make everybody they mad. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now, so everybody getting on madness. So I. So why you they show yourself? I be we go wrong for you. So why you they show yourself? Two people know the grace. When the roots of a tree start to decay gradually, they will send death to the branches of that same tree. And before you know it, the tree itself will start to die. I have settled down to trace the origin of the problem we have in this palace. And I discovered that the disunity between the queens is the problem. And if we are going to solve this problem, then the queens themselves must be the ones that will solve the problem. Imagine what they did to my daughter. It's unfair. When you go, I don't want to go into that. Please. In all palaces on planet Earth, 
Unity is their strength. They cannot do anything without unity. And I have been asking myself, why is it that I cannot have that unity in this palace of mine? Why? Father, there can never be peace or unity in this palace until Udoka and his useless siblings recognize their place. And if I should ask you, Tobenna, where is their place? Backyard. They are immigrants. They are illegal. Their mother was not married legitimately according to our tradition. My mother was married in a proper way. Hey, One more word from you, Tobenna, and I will have a reason to throw you out of this palace. Permanently. Throw you out. Permanently. It is very obvious that the age of a man has got nothing to do with maturity. For consistently you have continued to speak senselessly and irresponsibly. With all due respect, Father, I am not senseless. You are the one who has refused to say things clearly. These people are pretenders. Shut up. One more word from you, Tobena, and I will have a reason to throw you out of this palace permanently. You want to hear me? You have not said anything about what they did to me. Take it. Hey, listen, hey, 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 Amusha, I don't want to take a look at you. Eh? I don't want to speak anything about what they did to you. So called. Listen, I have discussed extensively with the people that were there. With my guards that are under oath, and they confirmed to me that what you got is what you bargained for. So why are you asking me to look at you? Listen to me. Why is it difficult for you all to see yourselves as members of the same family and resolve all your problems without a fight? Why? My king, this is unfair. My children did nothing to deserve this. Hey, listen, one yoga, please. I don't want to go into that. If I should ask you now to define what unfair means, I know you are going to fumble. I don't want to go into that place. Look at what is the problem? We are supposed to be the head of the children in this family. Are you finally telling me that you cannot lead? You cannot organize your siblings? Father, I am trying my possible best. But this seems to be beyond me. It is beyond me, Father. How? Father, all the efforts Udoka has made to bring peace and unity into this family all has proven abortive. That is because they do not respect him. They do not regard him. They call him a weakling. But I shall prove to them that we are not weaklings. Hey, shut up. Just shut up. If I should ask you now to explain to me how you will prove to them that you are not a weakling, I know you will fumble too. Listen, I want to end this meeting. I want all of us to go back to our various wings. Take a shower, eat, and as you sleep, you ponder over everything. So that tomorrow when we reconvene this meeting, after you must have pondered over everything, we are going to discuss this extensively and then take a decision as a family. Wow. And what did he say about that? He said he has to think about it. You know my boyfriend and the way he reasons most times. He loved this guy too much. Well, I hope he's not playing you. Why would you say a thing like that? Of course not. He loves me too. We love ourselves. Mm. It's just that he has a lot of things that he's handling now. There you go again. Always making excuses for him. But I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> <laughs>
What's the meaning of this? What was that all about? I think your brother loves me. You didn't notice the way he was just looking at me. Potaba? You see that place you're going? Potaba, no, there is no road there at all. This one, there is nothing to write home about. He's not good for you. I don't understand. What do you mean by that? Because he is not good for you. I am telling you the truth. I know him too well. Mm. That feeling, just kill it. Mm. There's nothing good there. Yeah. Just tell me you don't want your brother to marry me. Simple. Ah. Oh, please, let's change the topic. Why is he? <laughs> Listen, shut up. Shut up. Don't forget you are talking to a future king. When you are talking to people like me, you don't speak until you are asked to. Now you listen. They call me the man of war because I always go straight to the point. Study that proposal carefully. When you understand the deal, call me back. Do you understand? Hello, beautiful. Good afternoon, my friends. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. You look gorgeous, I must confess. Thank you. You see, I've been pretending all this while. But truth be told, just like a magnet, you captured my heart the very first day I set my eyes on you. And you're just saying it now? Yes, because I was respecting my sister. I like you. I like you too, my friends. Wow. This is good news. But we have a problem. I am not sure my sister will be comfortable with this. I know. She won't want me to measure shoulder with her. Women hate it when you compete with them. She will always want to be on top forever. I won't allow that, my friends. Good. In that case, we have to go on with our game, but keep it out of her. I do, my friends. Let's keep it to ourselves. Do you understand? Yes, I do. Do you? Do you? Do you? Do you? Don't do. <laughs> Let's see it with a kiss. To show you how much I love you, the man of war will see you. Thank you, my friend. Tell me you design the strategy. We'll make everybody they mad. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting on madness, so I so why you they show yourself? I be we go wrong for you. So why you they show yourself? Two people know they grace at a time. Oh, we stop this madness. Let us live as family. Stop this madness. Let us live in peace. Yo, brother, stop this madness. Let us live as family. I stop this madness. Let us live in peace. Yo. I will finish that girl. May may I? But we never. The baby. What kind of voice note did you send to me? Don't you know that I can take that up? Huh? You threatened my life. I requested for money, and the accountant told me you stopped him from approving it. What was the meaning of that? If you must know, I was only following father's instruction. That instruction might lead to your early grief. Yes, Udoka. Even if you don't have respect, you should have fear. Were you not afraid given such order? Don't you ever, I repeat, don't you ever send me that kind of voice note again. Do you hear me? I sent you a little voice note and here you are shivering like a chicken-hearted fellow. What will happen when I come for you? No, tell me. Listen, the person playing the music you are dancing, make sure he or she will come for your rescue when the time comes. I am not scared of you at all. I am not scared of you. Do you hear me? 
So anything you want to do, you do it. Because I already know that you are a noise maker. You cannot do anything. Yes. Look. Read my lips. I will cook for you. And when I'm done cooking for you, it will more than work at the beggy. Because you are too small to give such order. Yes. <laughs> a chicken that claims to be mad has not seen a drunken fox. For real? To be now. Bring it on. I have to cure to your madness. Look, I will tell you that Nenuguku and Nenugungu are profound. I will make you beg for mercy. But you are the one begging for mercy now. Can't you see? You are begging me for mercy. Me, Prince Tobena, aka Man of War, beg you for mercy. Tobena, you are a noisemaker. That's what you are. No problem. We shall see. You are trying me in this palace. Udoka, you have no such right. You have no right to tell the accountant not to approve the money I asked for. After all, it's not your money. No one is shed you care. No one is going to go to the compound to beggar. It's not possible. It won't happen. Messiagipe, you call me Kede. Nonsense, mannerless ape. No, 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 no. I am beginning to lose it. Tell your stupid son to stop meddling in my son's affair. Tell your children to stay off mine. I will not want you again. Queen Wayoko, what is it this time? Can't I stay for full one day without fighting and quarreling with you? Oh no. You will know no peace in this palace. Since you chose to leave all the single men in this palace, Land and choose to marry someone else's husband. You will know no peace. How is that my fault? Tell me, how is that my fault? The situation was beyond me. How many times will I tell you this? Oh, tell that stupid story to those your stupid children. You will know no peace in this palace as long as you and your children remain in this palace. My queen, all I have done is to please you and not to offend you. Yet you hate me. Please, leave my children out of this. They did nothing to deserve this. Don't be stupid. Now listen. Tell that your stupid son to revert whatever stupid order he gave to that accountant. Else, there'll be war. Second fiddle. Fool. Like fighting and quarreling all the time. I don't know what I've done this time. You're so sweet. <laughs> you are the best. Thank you. <laughs> I love you. I love you more. Call me the man of war. <laughs> the man of war. Baby, I can't wait to marry you. Then what are you waiting for? My brother is the problem here. I don't understand. Is he the one to tell you whom to marry or when to marry? Yes, you know, he will be the next king. So if you don't do what he wants, he will throw us out when he becomes king. This is wickedness. I thought Prince Udoka is a good man. Prince Udoka? Yes. He's evil. He's not a good man. He's just a good pretender. He pretends a lot. Why not report him to the king? Huh. He is the king's favorite. The king believes whatever he says. Is there something we can do? My prince, I want to marry you. The only way we can get married is by painting Udoka black. Let's make people hate him. Do you so, have anything in mind? 
My prince, anything. I'm ready. Can you seduce him and accuse him of raping you? <laughs> but that's not funny. Oh well, it might not be funny to you, but it is so funny to me. <laughs> Fine. So tell me, what would you like me to give to you on your birthday? Mm, well, get me anything, I eat. anything. Well, I don't know you too well, so I wouldn't know what you would want. Choma, just get me anything and uh, we appreciate it. No. Mm -mm. As for me, I want people to get me what I like. Okay, do you know what? Let's go to your room. Let me look around. I'm sure I will notice what you would like. See, there is no need of going to my room. Just get me anything and I will appreciate it. Come on. There's nothing wrong in showing me your room. Wait a minute. Are you scared you might not control yourself while with a beautiful lady in the room? Excuse me? That's ridiculous. I am in control of myself. Then prove me wrong. There's nothing wrong with that. Are you wrong? Yeah. Okay. Let's go to my room then. Thank you. My room? Okay. Now you see that I am. Yes, you're always too busy on me. So, what is going on here? Um, EJ, your friend here actually wants to see my room. In order to know what she can gift me on my birthday. Yes. Isn't that lovely? Ah, yes, I wanted to see your brother's room to know what he likes so I can know what to get for him. Choma, you would have asked me. But don't worry, bro. I shall tell her what you like. We are here already. Do you know what? Just go, I'm coming to meet you. Um, EJ, don't worry, just, just go. Hmm? When she's done saying whatever she wants to say, she'll mm. come and join you outside. Exactly. It's mm. fine. I shall wait outside. All right. Thank you. Um, on a second thought, I'm actually not doing anything right now. Why don't I go with you guys? Are you sure? Why not? I am very sure. Um, in fact, I've changed my mind. Prince Udoka, anything I get for you for your birthday, just take it like that. Oh. Mm. Let me go and chat with my friend outside. <sighs> okay, no problem. Okay. Uh, just take care of yourself, okay? It's fine. you. Uh. She is strong and she is brave. Like a lion, she is bold and fear no man. She fears no man. She's a woman of peace, but knows how to fight. No one challenges her and goes cut free. Hey, she's a warrior. She's a warrior. She always go on fire for fire. And battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give yeah. you peace. But she always goes fire welcome. for fire. Cheese. And battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace. She fares no man at all. Please feel free. Around me, especially. I'm are you? Yes. All right. You see, I actually called you here because I figured we'll soon become co-wives. So I want us to put heads together and bring peace to the man we love. Wow. <laughs> I'm excited we're actually thinking in the same direction. I know. You see, I have this affinity for peace and I always advocate for it. Hmm. It's good to hear that from you. Thank you. <laughs> so tell me, I hope your boyfriend is doing everything possible to protect his right as the heir to the throne. Prince Sudoka is not actually obsessed with the throne. His sisters are the ones drumming it into his ears. You 
You mean he has no plans of dragging the throne with Prince Tobina? Not at all. But he said his father wanted him to ascend the throne. Which means even if he doesn't want to become king, his father will still make him the king. Exactly. But why are these questions? Uh, um, 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 I, I, mean, I mean, I just um, I just want to get to the bottom of this problem so we can put an end to it as a team. It's good to know that. I can't really wait for all this to be over. Ah, not to worry, darling. It will be over in no time. Especially now that we are working as a team. But first, you must tell me every of Prince Udoka's moves and plans. That way, we will work together as a team and put an end to this problem for good. No problem. Do you? Do you. Good girl. Gone and I feel. As in, uh, I have everything. Don't worry. She will be of help to us. With her, we will know every plans and secrets of Udoka. Then we take it off from there. But uh, that girl just seems so dumb to me. I couldn't get any tangible information from her. It's gradual. Make her trust you. That's all. I can trust you and uh, we can use her as we please. Yeah, um, how about Tobin now? Is he playing his part? He's still on it. Well then, um, just be careful and smart about this. Trust your daughter. Listen. <laughs> You know, the truth is that in my days, we had amazing dance steps. Something that was very different from what you have these days. <laughs> what about your fashion sense? Was that mm. also amazing? Mm. That is the word. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Are you saying that the dress that seduced your father the great king of Umunono was not amazing. <laughs> I don't know. Well, father said it all, you know. It was amazing to you people at that time. But, but not to us anymore, you know. <laughs> it is still amazing. I'm still wondering how amazing it was. Because such kind of fashion sense can only be qualified in one word. Konkosa. <laughs> Well, I don't have a problem how you decide to qualify our fashion. <laughs> is that not what you children of these days do? Always finding ways to qualify things. But let me tell you something. Whether you call it Kokosa or you call it anything, we had a very wonderful experience, fashion-wise, when we were growing up. <laughs> and the Sopido shoe, you love them too? Oh, why not? Very beautiful shoes. Very beautiful shoes. Come to think of it. I wonder how we wear and love those shoes. I don't think. Please, I need to take this call. I will drive back. You call it Sophie. Biao Zodima, or whatever you call yourself, the time is up. You may now live with these urchins you call children. Yes, it's our turn now. But we all can stay here. There is enough space for everyone. Ijoma, Ogo, please come over here. Yeah, madam. Let's call a spade a spade. You people do not belong here. So take your miserable self, your bleached son, and your two confused looking daughters out of this palace before I do something you all will regret. To be Mind the way you talk to my mother. That's very shut up. If I slap you, you will change color. Like you can even do anything. Listen to me, all of you. 
get lost. We are not moving an inch. We are not. If you will not stay here with us, then you might as well take your miserable selves out of this place. My friend, will you shut up? Women don't talk when men are talking. Have you lost your sense of respect or have you forgotten this is Africa? Mother, let's just go. It's not worth it. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Go, Ijoma, please, let's leave. Never. Mother, we are not going anywhere. Tobena, do your worst. Come close to me. Touch me and I shall teach you a great lesson. Don't forget you are talking to Tobenna, the man of war that has a gun. I will skin you alive, Ijoma. Watch your tongue. If you don't live here in the next few seconds, I will tell you that the Enugu and the Enugu are Leave, I'm Ijoma. losing it. Please, let's leave. Mother, please stop saying that. I can't allow this fool to be tossing me around in my father's palace. It's not done. He can't do that. Not even his mean mother would do that. What? What? That's what you want. Do it! She's a warrior, she always go on fire for fire and battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace, but she always go on fire for fire and battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace. She fares no man at all. Hey. How could you do that, Ijama? You could have killed him. What has come over you? Eh? Mother, you should leave Ijama alone. So Bena got what he deserved. Will you shut up? Shut up! What if he had died? Did you talk about that? Eh? We would have left there if not for Ijama's stubbornness. This is crazy! We should be advocating for peace in this palace. Everyone cannot be advocating for peace, Udoka. I am not for peace and unity. I am for what anyone brings. He's been parading himself as a man of war. I am a woman of war. I give it back to anyone once he or she brings it on. But peace is what we need in this palace. I want peace as well. But everyone must want the same. If they give me war, I will return it back to them. I cannot take shit from anybody. Not anymore. I won't. Mother, we are not against you and your son advocating for peace. But allow us to advocate for what we believe in. Will you keep quiet? Come on. For father's sake, let's give them peace. Huh? The king will be fine. You can only cure a madman if only he wants to be cured. It's very obvious that Tobena's madness has no cure. So no one should disturb me. That fool almost killed my brother today. What kind of... Wait. Hello, hello. Hello, DPO. Good. Now listen. I want you and your men in the palace right now. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, someone nearly killed my only son. Yes, please come to the palace with your men right now. I'm expecting you. Thank you. Very good for them. Okay. Um, it will be. How is Tobena doing and where is Ujo? Tobena is fine. Okay. Ujo insisted on staying there until the maid that will take over comes. She will soon be back. I'm just, I'm just fed up of all this nonsense happening in this palace. Eh? What was the meaning of that? Your Highness, I hope you are not expecting that animal that nearly killed my only son to go unpunished. Hey, Your Highness! 
Yes, DPO. Yes, I'm aware of that. I have been informed. You were given an instruction to come to the palace and pick what? Listen, right here, right now, I abort that oppression. I don't want any police officers in my palace. What happened is family, and we're going to resolve it within the family. Thank you for informing me, and I am going to call you right back. Your Highness, what's the meaning of that? What is the meaning of that? Eh? I hope you're not going to allow that girl go unpunished and nearly kill my only son. I hope you're not. Listen, Maya, my young girl, I don't want anybody to call the police ever again for anything that happens in this palace. Whatever problem we have in this palace must be resolved within the four walls of the palace. Please. Father, this is so unfair. It is so unfair, Father. Amusha, I sincerely think you have a duty to sit your brother down and talk to him. <laughs> I have been briefed of what actually happened. His violent attitude caused everything. It is so clear now that even the young ones, the young sisters, they are learning the violence even more than him. Talk to him because the time to stop is now. They keep looking for his trouble. You are, and you are not going to manage that one. I will deal with you. You're you say right. you. You say you want him. You say you tell me if it's you say you want to marry him. You say you don't know. I wonder if you're my daughter. Are you? Sometimes I wonder what. Hey, what is wrong with you, mom? Are you my daughter? You are not. I will. I will kill you one day. Yeah. You will tell me one day. I wonder. If... Don't mind what mommy said. You did well by fighting for what belongs to us. You know, like I enjoy all this conflict. I honestly don't. But Tobina is taking more than required. Too much. Get out of here! Get out! Get out! No sane person touches the tail of a lion, whether dead or alive. By the time we are done with both of you, when you hear our names, you will hide in fear. Look, I will teach both of you a lesson that you will never ever forget. Hey! 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 Leave here now before we prepare objects we have for both of you. Leave here. And you were saying? Still water runs very deep. Next time you want to do something, just go ahead and do it and stop talking. Gosh, you talk too much. Come on, fight me. Action speaks better than words. Leave. It's not over yet. Oh. It's not over yet. Get out of this place. We are just running to. No, come back. It's yours. You too much. You are something else. Ijuma, we are twin, but you carried all the energy and strength. She is strong you are and more she is brave. You are something else. Give me five. Give me no five. Man. Come back and fight. No Nonsense. She's a woman of peace, but knows how to fight. No one challenges her and goes cut free. Hey, she's a warrior. She's a warrior, she always go on fire. You can no longer talk. When it comes to talking, you won't be able to say much. But when it comes to fighting, you will be ready before anybody else. Why? Father, I don't like trouble. But I don't have the strength to run away when trouble comes. Can you hear yourself speak? Ijoma, you are a woman. You are not supposed to be violent. Can you see what you did to your brother? But Father, he cost it. I was on my own. Listen, you have to learn to avoid trouble. Is your mind you wearing like this growing up? What changed? Father, the maltreatment is just too much. I couldn't bear it. That's all. You know what? I don't want it to be reported ever again that you were seen anywhere fighting. Father, I just wish you can tell them to stop the provocation. <laughs> I just said, 
I don't want it to be reported ever again that you are engaging anybody in a fight. Did you hear me? Hearing is one thing. Doing it is another. We all know where this is coming from, Father. Let us tackle it from the source. And then peace will reign. I do not want you to feel bad over what I'm about to say. But that is exactly how I feel. And what are you talking about? You know, sometimes when I see how you handle and relate with these people, I just feel you're not man enough. Do you realize that is an insult to me? How can you say things like this about your brother? I'm sorry if you feel insulted, but that is the truth. That's how I feel. I just made my point. You need to up your game, bro. Come on. Tobena is your age mate, quite right. But you are the senior. Come on. Are you aware that Tobena is back to this palace? I learned he was discharged from the hospital this afternoon. Of course I know. And that is exactly why we are having this conversation. There will be more fears now. We need to stand tall to overcome. Think about it. She is strong and she is brave. Why would I have a sister in the mood of a man? Why? She fears no man. She's a woman of peace, but no. Hey, Mobe. This meeting is not about you, but it has a lot to do with you. How? You must be careful on how you relate with those people. Especially now that they have declared war against us by sending your only brother to the hospital. And the king did nothing about it. He didn't even allow the police to come here to arrest anybody. They want war. Mother, we will give them war. And I promise it is going to be very brutal. Why are you doing this? Why can't we allow peace to reign? Be a are you with us or against us? Eh? Why are you sounding like an opposition? If you have nothing serious to say, just shut up to avoid slap. I will slap you. Every day, you will slap me. Every day, you will call a slap. It is when you see everybody that you have power. Go outside there and slap someone else. Let's see. Everybody. 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 You make more sense when you are not talking. Tobina, please sit down for us. Calm down. Calm down, please. Please. Anna, Kodim, Anna, Konana. I called this meeting to let us know that Lolo Ozodima and her children have turned the king against us. Can't you see that he always support them even when they are at fault? I feel it strongly in my spirit that that woman used voodoo on the king. Okay. When I was saying it, people said I exaggerate. Oh, well, now, three way. I will make sure they pay dearly for this. They must beg for mercy. It is settled. For sure, they will pay. Mother, how now? You're saying they're going to pay. How? Have you all seen that girl, Ijoma? That girl is already running mad. She's crazy. See, that girl is not going to spare us. She's ready to kill each and every one of us. I've only keep quiet. Kill her, each and every one of us. I'm talking to her. Ordinary Ijoma. What is Ijoma? Ijoma is too small. Oh man, I'm tired of her. Ijoma, I'm tired. What is Ijoma? You know, I think we should just eliminate Udoka first. And then we can think about what to do with the rest. Beautiful idea. That's one. If I hear a word of this out of here, you are dead. Udoka, stupid girl. Tobena, mm -hmm. what about the girl that was supposed to accuse Udoka of me? The useless girl failed. But well, she said she will try again. She has to try again. Let her try, you. please. There's no time. Mom, this is not fair. Why are you allowing them to do this? Why? 
You are not supposed to be in this meeting. Are you sure this is your blog? What is it? Are, are you, are you sure? Are you, are you, are you, no, 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 allow her to leave. Allow her to leave. Don't make her wait. I will, I will, I will Don't make her wait. Wait. I'll have to some sense into the Go, go, go. Leave here. Leave here. Into this idiot. I'm not going to give it. Oh my god. Where did she emanate from? DNA test is needed. Very DNA test is needed because this is not our blood. I swap level. What is this? They swapped her. This is not our blood. Please, mother, are you sure you gave that to this girl? Because I'm beginning to suspect how. I'm beginning to suspect how. I'm She is strong and she is brave Like a lion she is bold and fear no man She fears no man She's a woman of peace but... but your friend is not here I know I came bearing a special gift I know you will Please, leave. My friends, believe me, I've been yearning for your touch all my life. I can't wait for you to test what I have in stock for you. Sweet in the middle and up above. <laughs> leave this very minute before I ask the guys to throw you out. Come on, my friends. Trust me, I know you will like this. Will you just leave? Friends, stop being childish. Joma, you know I have a girlfriend and you know her. My friends, I'm so... Trust me, no one will hear about this. So don't worry about that. It's our little secret. Oh my friends. My friends, why would you do that? My prince, you call. I know why you allowed her in. I know you see her as one of those visitors that have direct access to the palace. But she has just lost it. I do not want to ever see her again. My prince. Do I make myself clear? Yes, ma'am. Excuse me. Hey, 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 hey. You have heard the coming king. Can you please excuse yourself out? Please. I'm disappointed in you. Yes, I'm totally disappointed in you. I gave you an assignment. A simple one at that. But you failed to deliver. Yet you want to be my girlfriend, you want to be the queen. Do you know what it takes to be a queen? My prince, I'm sorry. I tried everything I could, but he sent me away. He sent you away? Yes. Look at you. Ordinary Udoka, you could not seduce or attract. So what makes you think you can attract someone like me? I don't understand my love. I said I'm sorry. Will your sorry solve my problem? I hate it when you say I'm sorry. Will your sorry solve my problem? Eh? Ordinary assignment you could not deliver. What are you doing around the man of war? If you are not useful, you cannot be around me. I don't keep stupid people. Yes. In fact, it's over. My prince, you said you love me. You must be a fool to believe that. Give me one reason why I should love you. Is there money on your face? And I love you in Ekego. Wait, my prince. You're joking, right? I am not joking. I'm serious. It is over between us because you have nothing to offer. Your brain is empty. I gave you an assignment and you failed to deliver. So what are you doing around me? My prince, you, you said you want to marry me. Believe me, I love you. I'm sorry. You must be a fool to believe that. Are you dreaming? My Don't touch me. I'm sure your brain is in coma. Me, marry you as what? As the most beautiful girl in town. Listen. I told you all that so that you will deliver. But you failed to deliver. 
I don't keep stupid people, don't you understand? Now get out of my presence before I call my guards to throw you out. My prince, I know you are angry, but believe me, I'm sorry. Ask me to do anything whatsoever, I will. Okay, whatsoever I ask, yes. you will. I want you to believe. Obey me if you love me. Get out of this place. I'm sorry. Please, your prince. Useless idiot. I toasted you for, for, for a little assignment. Simona Kakolov. I toasted you for the purpose. Deliver. No. Yes, you want to be my girlfriend. You want to be a queen. I don't accommodate dummies. It's either you're useful or get lost. Anuma. Enugugu ne enugungu abrofu. Enugugu ne enugungu abrofu. I hate associating with failures. The useless girl failed. She could not even lure him into the room, talk more of seducing or accusing him. I knew it. I knew that that weakling will not look at any other girl apart from his girlfriend. That's not important. What do we do now? Let's use his girlfriend. I am disappointed at you all. Can you hear yourselves? Who invited you here? Are you supposed to be here? No, like jokes apart, for real. Are you supposed to be here? You, you are very... Get out. Get out. This is my father's house. I am not going anywhere. Ebube, you disgust me. Get out. Get out. I'm off here. I'm off here the area of battery. See, please. To be. Amuche, I am saying it. That girl will not agree to this. No. Everyone has a price. I am saying that that girl will not agree to this. Afoma, she's too principled and good. She will not agree to this at all. And I am telling you that everyone has a price. I will make her an offer she can't reject. Exactly. Watch me handle this. Enugugu. Enugungo approve. You called me and I followed you because I have strong respect for royalty. Why are you looking at me like this? There is something I want you to do. Once you do it, you will be five million naira richer. Please, if it is something bad, just forget about it, because I won't do it. It depends on your own definition of bad. But trust me, it's something you can do. And what is that? I want you to accuse Prince Udoka of rape. God forbid! I can never do such a thing! Never! Low your voice. Low your voice. Ten million naira awaits you. I can do the transfer immediately. Prince Udoka, you are heartless. I just interacted with your woman and realized you've not been discussing business with her. Which is wrong. Buro go bone na ka ko love. E ko to love. E ko business. Maka na enugugu na enugugu abrofo. What is he talking about? And what are you doing here? Nothing. He just called me. You don't look okay. Wait, did he say anything? Did he touch you? No. I'm having a slight headache. I need to get some rest. Okay, why don't you follow me to my room so that you, you can rest? And I, I'll get you your medication. Don't worry, my love. Let me just go home. I'll see you. Welcome. 
welcome, Father. Thank you. So how was the meeting? Same old story. They want the train to rotate, but no one has plans on how to make it happen. In other words, there's no hope from them. For now, no hope. They think it's something money can sell. But none of them is saying anything reasonable. Father, I really hope no one will drag this throne with you after we succeed in making the king agree to our terms. Never. They don't have the boss to do that. In fact, they cannot do that. Never. Good. Because I'm doing everything I can. Working tirelessly with everything I've got. And there will be results soon. <laughs> That's good of you. Adania. Father. Whoever <laughs> dares me must go six feet below. Yes. I will say it again and again and again. Whoever dares me must go six feet down. I don't care who you are, where you're coming from. And that's it. So you have actually vowed never to be useful to yourself. Every day that breaks, you sit down here, smoking, drinking, carrying a gun as if a gun has become a walking stick. Father, why are you bothered about the way I choose to live my life. I am bothered with the way you are living your life because you are my son. Not only you are my son, you are a prince in Umunana Kingdom. Oh, um, Dad, that sounds funny. What? Yes, because the last time I checked, you are not treating me like your son. Listen, nobody has been treating you badly. You are the person who is forming that notion in your own head. No. It does not exist anywhere. No, Father. Stop pretending. I know you do not like me and I don't like you. So mind your business and let me be. Do you know what? I don't have time for your nonsense. I just came to tell you. As long as you live under my roof, then you must submit yourself under the rules I created for this house. Father, with all due respect, I won't. Father, I am a full grown man. You can't be ordering me around because you are my father. Yes, you can't be ordering me around. I'm not a baby. Listen to me. If you want to continue to live here in this palace, then you must urgently make a decision. You must stop smoking here. You must stop drinking every day like a drunken seller. You must submit that gun you carry around every day. If you are not ready to do this, then get ready to be thrown out of this palace. Father, I can't stop smoking. I can't stop drinking and I won't hide my gun. It's my life, so I run it the way I deem fit. Oh, really? Yes. Then I must have to tell you that I have an edge. Because a man who has no money is a crippled man. If you are not ready to live in this palace according to the rules I have created, then you will stop getting any money from me and you will stop getting any support from any of my businesses. Father, you will do no such thing. Yes, you can dramatize for all I care, but do not tamper with my source of income. You are the fool who has been dramatizing. Listen to me, you have no source of income. The money you have been spending all your life, my money, and if you are not ready to do what I have just said, then you will be thrown out. Resist being thrown out and you will discover yourself for the remaining days of your life in prison. When you design the strategy, we make everybody they mad. Remember, say every mal I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting own madness. So I so why you they show yourself? I run nonsense. You people are all mad. Oh yes, you people are all mad. I will not drop my gun and I'm not stepping out of this palace. Very much meta. Around nonsense. What's going on? Mind your business. How dare you speak to the king in that manner? I said, mind your business and live long. But when yes. I can see you are drunk in stupidity. Don't let it destroy you. Doka, you are a fool. You 
by a big fool. What's your business? If you don't mind your business, you will have a bad end. Mind your business. Or what? Would you please give him? Shoot me, man. Come on, shoot me. Huh? I'm not afraid of you. Shoot me. Please, please don't shoot. He's your brother. He's your Shut blood. Up. He is not my brother. That's my brother. Shoot his car out. Stupid boy. Sorry, please. I beg you. Yes. Please. That's a gun you are holding. Shh. Please drop that gun. I shoot me, brother. Shoot me. Come on, shoot me. Shoot him now. I am not your brother. Say it. You are not my brother. Again? You are not my brother. Again? You are not my brother. You are not my brother. You are not to be honest with you, I almost peed on my clothes. I was shaking and praying to God at the same time. This is unbelievable. What? It was not a small thing. It was when he released the first bullet that father rushed to the scene. So what did he do after that? He threatened father that any time he does not tell Udoka to stay off his case, he's going to kill him. What? Wait. You mean that fool pointed a gun at the king? And father told him that any day he touches any of his children, that he's going to shoot him. Wait, you mean that pig had the guts to point a gun at the lion of this great land? Oh, he should just wait for me. He should wait for me. No, my sister, he's moving around with a gun. Oh, please. Tobena that I know is a coward. He can do nothing. He cannot even kill a rat. That's not true. Please forget it. I know Tobena. He's doing all these things to scare you people so that he can get away with anything he does. But I will make you guys see him for who he really is. He's an animal. A swine. What? Joma, drop that gun. Sit your ass down. I'm warning you for the very last time. Drop that gun. And I said sit your freaking ass down before I end up killing my stepbrother. Joma, you are playing with fire. I will consume you. Stop. Drop that gun. You know the difference between you and I? You use your mouth a lot. I use my hands a lot. Don't start what you can't finish, Ijoma. Drop my gun. There he goes again. Talking like an untrained parrot. Tobena, if I do not kill you in this house, I promise you, no one else will, even in this life. You better kill me now, because if you don't, I will kill you. If you fail to take a strong man's sword when he was on the ground, do you think you can ever take it when he gets up? Tobena, you could have killed me when you had the chance to. But you didn't. You think you can ever kill me again? Please, please don't shoot for the sake of the king, please. Please. Drop my gun. You know what? Today is your lucky day. Oh. 
Tobena. Shoot me if you have the balls. To her, don't listen to her, please. Please, Tobena. Please. You get lost. Ah, ah. You why are you Come back here. Yeah? Come back here, you bloody maiden. So you have the gods to peep. You were peeping, right? Kneel down. Kneel down! Hands up. Close your eyes. You, design the strategy. you will remain we'll here till tomorrow. Remember, I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting on madness. So I Come on, baby. How can you allow that girl make you feel this way? That girl is evil. She's mean. She's wicked. She can kill. Then kill her before she kills you. Excuse me? Yes. Did you just say that? I should kill a daughter of Omonono and face the spirits of Omada for the rest of my life. Is that what you're saying? Oh, please. Spare me that Omada nonsense. Didn't you just say she can kill? Or would you rather she kills you? Listen, I can do so many things, but killing is out of it. I can't kill. There's always a first time. I mean, if she's really as deadly as you describe her to be, then there's nothing wrong with taking her out of the picture. There is something wrong with that. Oh. I know she's a thorn on my flesh, but killing her is out of it. We must find another way to take her out. Why don't you have a gun if you can't use it? My gun is for protection, not for killing. I can't kill. Do you know the consequences of killing a daughter of Umunono? Do you know? Let's look for another way. Does she have a boyfriend? Why do you ask? If she does have a boyfriend, we can use him to make her do what we want. Who doesn't have a boyfriend these days? Hmm. Of course, she has a boyfriend. But the question should be, will it work? You can bet it will. He's the perfect weakness to explore and make her do what we want. It will work. And what is the meaning of this madness? What are you people doing here? This is supposed to be our wing and you're not allowed here. Says who? Who gave that stupid order that we are not allowed to pass here? And why didn't you greet us when you're just seeing us right now? Why didn't you say hello to us? What was that rubbish you just spewed? Have you lost it or something? Well, I do not have your time. I have someone waiting for me outside. Excuse me. If you as little as try to move these cursed looking legs of yours to walk out on us, I will beat you mercilessly that even your mother will not be able to recognize you. Who the hell do you think you are? You are the one cursed. Your family members are cursed. And if you do not take your smelly body out of my sight right now, you will get it hot from me. I smell? Yeah. Did you say I smell? Yes, I said you mm. Did you say I smell? <laughs> Brown skin girl. Can I sit? There's no need. I will never do what you're asking me to do. You don't have a choice. Yes. I have a choice. And my choice is no. Your brother will be framed up. He will lose his job and spend the rest of his life in jail. I will also make sure my mother withdraws the scholarship given to your sister. My prince, 
please. Don't do this to me, please. I beg you. Make your choice and don't waste my time. And if anyone else hears about this, I swear I will destroy your family. Please, please, don't do this to me, please. My friends, my friends. My friends, please, don't do this. Because you look like you are in the wilderness. Are you sure you're fine? Babe, I'm okay. I'm fine. I was just thinking about the errands my mother sent me. So many things to do, you know. Do you need my help? Babe, just relax. It's no big deal. It's fine. Baby. My mind is telling me that you are. You're hiding something from me. Are you sure you're fine? Babe, I'm okay. Trust me, I'm fine. Okay then. Let's go inside. Okay. Alright. All right. I don't know why you are moving this far. You are tampering with my means of livelihood, and that's not fair. Okay, okay. Just give me until the end of business today, and I will handle things. I mean it. Just dismantle this deadly structure you have set up against me. Why are you talking like this? Why are you behaving like this? I was only trying to defend my family from the terror of my stepbrother. But I cannot marry a violent woman. You have to stop. Or we'll just end things. What do you mean by that? Since we've been together, have I been violent? Honestly, I don't know. I mean, I don't like what has been happening around. But I can't just watch them throw us out of our father's house. I can't. Ijoma, you have to make a choice. I or your violent lifestyle. Which one do you choose? Why are you doing this to me? Is it because you know I love you? I love you too. But you need to understand that you are a woman. And you need to stop acting like a doubt. It's alright. Just because of you, I'll stop. That's my girl. In that case, I will see you tomorrow. See you. Baby. Darling, I need your help. Anything for you, my love. I need you to breed fear into our former so that she can do what I want her to do. Yes. Threaten her. Just make sure she... Just, I don't know, but I want you to make her do what I want her to do. Come on, baby, I can't. I mean, you know I'm trying to make her trust me. I can't risk it. Listen, I understand. Make it look like you're looking out for her. Yes. Well, I, I, okay. I'll try and figure out something. So tell me, how did you make her boyfriend succumb. So oh, that. I told you you could trust me. You see, her boyfriend works for a good friend of mine. Yes, I made him threaten him with a sack. I mean, everyone has a price. You are the best. I know. Thank you very much. Always, You're baby. such a darling. Always. 
Now I can do whatever I want to do without a woman standing on my way. You know, my love, I keep wondering why you're so scared of such a small girl. She is not a small girl. In fact, she is not a human being. She is a witch. You won't understand until you have something to do with her. Diana, what a drama. Drama. Honestly, Obong, I am tired of all this. I just wish we could be normal people with normal problems. This whole thing is becoming too much. It's just too much for me to bear. I know. Everything will be fine. When Udoka becomes the queen, he's going to put an end to all this nonsense. We'll be fine. <coughs> In your dreams, oh yes, in your dreams. Udoka is a slave and for that reason he can never become king. Over my dead body will that happen. You and your family members are slaves and will soon be thrown out of this palace. The earlier you understand that, the better for you all. You wish? I pity you. You seem to have a brain damage. It's obvious that your brain is not working well. Are you talking to me? You heard me loud and clear. You are nothing but a mistake to humanity. Ah! You slapped me! And I will, I will disfigure your face the next time you speak when you are not asked to. <laughs> Do you want your own? Do you want your own? Ijuma, you watched him slap me. Do you want your own? Slaves. Now get lost. You will pay for this, I promise. You will pay for this. Amara Chukuduba. Onye nari be yanaro. Amara Chukuduba o. Onye nari be yanaro. Slaves can never rule. Enuguku, enugungo, abrofu. Strange today. What is going on? Huh? I've missed you so much. Can't you see? Yeah, I, I, I have missed you too. But you are really behaving strange. Your dress. You are even drinking spirit. You have never done this before. Hey, change is constant. Oh please, tell me what is this all about? Why are you behaving like an old man, babe? Can't you say I've missed you so much? Please, let's go into the room, please. Okay, please, please. fine, if, if you insist. Let's go. Good afternoon, my dear. Udoka, mm. you are needed at the site immediately. There is conflict between the workers. You need to go and take care of things now. Mother, can't it wait? I heard that they are becoming violent. Mother, men will always be men. They will settle their problems themselves. This problem is very different. 
You need to go there before someone dies. Um, Alpha Mama, my dear. Please, wait for him. He will soon come back. Baby, I, I will be with you shortly, okay? Enjoy yourself. What is going on? I have been expecting to hear you scream. What is going on? We were back going to the room when Lolo sent him out for something urgent. So I'm waiting for him. Listen, I listen real good. The earlier you do this, the better for you. Don't say I did not know you. No, no, no. you so much. He said he's gonna take you around the world. Honestly, the truth is that Afoma, you are really lucky. You are. I mean, every woman out there should be praying for their men to love them just the way my brother loves you. He said if not for us, he would have eloped with you a long time ago. <laughs> That's crazy, honestly. <sighs> but come to think of it, I don't like the way you look. Is there a problem? Yes. I'm okay. Fine. You don't look fine to me. Yes. I'm actually having some difficult situations. I don't know what to do about them. Difficult situations? Just us about it. I'm in between making a choice. Between two things that I love the most. What if that, if I may ask? Did you tell your boyfriend about it? No, please, don't tell him for now, please. Till I'm ready to tell him myself, please. Don't tell him anything. I understand how you feel, Afoma, but listen to me. You really have to calm down. This is about you. You have to make the right decision. It is only best to make the right, just follow your heart. Oh my goodness, you're still here? Yes, my friend. Are you okay? Maybe you should go and come back tomorrow. I never knew this would take this long. I'll wait a little longer, my queen. Uh, uh, so, do you need something to eat? No, my queen. I'm fine. Okay. She is strong and she is brave Like a lion she is bold and fear no I can't believe this Are you still here? Don't you have job to do? If you're not jobless, won't you go home and help your parents? Good evening my queen I've been waiting for Prince Sudoka I was just coming to sit down here Oh please shut up Are you that useless? Even if you are jobless or useless, won't you go home? If, let me tell you something, if you don't leave this palace now, I will ask the guard to throw you out. A shower. What is going on here? Is it not this, this thing that has refused to go home? Even if you don't have anything to do, can't you go home and help your parents? Come on, get out of here! No, no. Mom, is not fair. You're supposed to send her away now. Afoma, come back! Afoma! Mother, how could you? How could you be the one to spoil my plans? How? How could I have known? This is the reason you children should involve me in your plans. I didn't know. Mom, are you still supporting this? Will you shut your trap, baby? What is wrong with you? Shut this mouth of yours. Stupid girl. Anyway, I am beginning to think you are not my plot. I, I am beginning to think I'm not the one that gave birth to you. You were exchanged in the hospital, I'm sure of that. Why are you behaving like this? 
this is wrong. Very, very wrong. My friend, will you shut up? Please, Toby, just calm down. Leave this, 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 this gossip here. Cho, cho, cho. What do we do? I will make sure the girl comes back here tomorrow for this. But we all should pray that she does not talk to anyone else about this. She should not. Because we were this close to sending Udoka out. I can't do this. I can't. Please help me talk to him. Please. I do wish I could. But you know he wouldn't listen to me. I can't. I can't do this. I can't hurt someone who hasn't done anything wrong to me. Afoma, listen. Udoka will be fine. He's a prince and no one would raise dust about this. But you? <laughs> you will lose everything, including your brother in jail. Is that what you want for yourself? Udoka will never forgive me. He will. Afoma, stop worrying. He will. I mean, just trust me this once. Do it. After which, you would confess everything to him. Make him understand you were forced to do this. You didn't have a choice. He will forgive you, especially because he loves you. Are you sure? Of course, I'm sure. <laughs> Afoma. He will not forgive me. He will. <laughs> You have to, okay? <laughs> Mother, I feel it strongly in my spirit that if we sustain our agitation, Father will give in and tell us the truth. What we planned. What? What? Hey. Now listen. Ibu, let me tell you something. If you ever mention a word of what we plan here to anyone outside, kill you and kill myself. Why are you like this? Why are you being foolish? Can you not see that these people are trying to use you against your own family? You know, I just don't understand what is going on in that skull of yours. Ebube, it's time you realize that we are the family that can stand by you anytime, any day. Not, not them. Are you people begging her not to talk? I don't understand. Are you people begging her not to talk? No, talk. Ileke, talk. Let me tell you. If you expose us, if you expose our plan, eh, I will disfigure your face and make sure no man looks your way. You are you there is nothing as worse as concealing such terrible secrets. Sometimes I wonder how I managed to. Come into this part of the family. Will you shut up? Who even wants you here? Who wa Get out! Get out now before I break! Come, you, come on, move! You want us to break you into the group? No, no, no! Get sure? out! I'm not sure this is my fault. I'm not sure. A foolish thing. This is not fair. Father! Father! I know you regret having me as a son. But must you make it obvious every now and then? The next time you barge into my presence without any iota of respect, like you just did, I am going to order the guards to grab you and throw you into the palace guard room, and you remain there until you learn your manners. All right, Dad. All right, Father. Greetings, Father. Long live your highness, but there is a problem. There is a big problem. I demanded for money from my accountant and he told me that you banned me from having a dime. I tried to assess my office 
but to no avail. You changed my password. My fingerprints can no longer access my office. What is going on? Have you disowned me? Am I no longer your son? Listen, a man who has made money should be able to protect that money from fools. Okay? Are you calling me a fool? And what are you? What are you if I may ask? Listen, a legitimate man who has made money the hard way must be able to develop the capacity to know the people who can protect that money and those who can squander same. Father, with all due respect, out of all your assets, that company is the only one you left under my custody. So why the sudden change? Do you want to take it back? That's my only source of income. And because it is only source of income you think you have, you believe you have what it takes to run it down? I left that company under your care with plenty of money. And recently, I just engaged the services of some private investigators to look into the books of all the companies. And I was shocked to discover that the same company I left under your care with plenty of money is actually on the verge of bankruptcy. Come on, father. How is that my fault? The country is fluctuating. The inflation level is on 14.9. The country is in recession. How is that my fault? Why would someone single me out for blame? You, you, you know your problem? Your problem is that you are a fool. And that's why you will not know that it's only a fool that will never take responsibility for his actions and inactions. And that is who you are. And let me tell you something. Until you learn how to take responsibility for your actions and inactions, do not ever make appearance before me again. Father, I am tired of this conversation. Can we keep it for another day? But please, call your accountant. I need five million naira urgently. If any, maybe not. Mm -hmm. I need that money. You are a fool. It, the more you talk, the more I see the fool talking. Now, what makes you think you can ever have money from me again after what you did? Listen to me. I am not going to give you any money again, and you are not going to assess any money from that company ever again. Now, get out of my sight. What is going on here? Am I no longer your blood? Have you disowned me? Father, please don't tell me you're serious on this threat. Please, this is serious. Do you want to grip with me? It is not a threat. What I just made is a statement of fact. And like you said, to Ben now you are completely crippled. You are not ever going to have access to money again from that company until you regain your sanity. Now, get out of my sight. Leave! This is not fair. This is not fair. Have you disowned me? Am I not your blood? You are the, you are the fool who has been very unfair to yourself. Yaudoka, so you have succeeded in talking father into seizing my source of income. I hope you are happy now. Tobin, if you have any issues with dad, you can settle with him and leave me alone. No, you go tell father to release my source of income the same way you convinced him to seize my company. Else, I will do something that you might not survive. Those whose spam canals were cracked for them by a benevolent spirit should always stay humble. Look at where your pride and arrogance has finally landed you. Udoka, you're a foolish man, but let me tell you what you don't know. No matter what, a full-grown tree can never be bent into your walking stick. Yes. No matter what you and father do, I will always be on top of this game. I am a lion and this jungle is mine. Don't also forget that the lion is the king of the jungle, but he is also afraid of flies. The death that you kill a puppy will never let it perceive smell. Hello? Yeah. Udoka. Yeah, once you come up with a proper business plan that um, we enable the investors to invest and recover their money, you just get back to me. Yeah, we will always find the money. No matter the amount, we will find the money. Yeah, no problem. Okay. 
here you are promising a total stranger that you will always find the money. Yet you find it difficult to give me what I need. Tobinna, you have what you need. You are treacherous one. It's where we have a problem. Udoka. Tobinna. Udoka. Tobinna. Udoka. Tobinna. How many times did I call you? Please just. Enuguoku. Enuguongo. Approve. We shall see. No, for real, I got this here. We shall see. I know you can solve the problem in this family. Why have you decided not to solve it? Why? You are a fool to tell me that. Are you cursed or what? For once, why can't you possibly behave like a child that came from me? This is highly unacceptable. I will not take this. What does it mean by that? Can you imagine that said I have all I need? What do I have? What? What do I have? Ordinary one million naira monthly. Is that enough? Is that enough of my doings? Is that enough? What is he talking about? Who provoked you, son? You won't believe what father did to me. I'm in shock. Father crippled me financially. How could you go? He crippled my source of income. This is the handwork of that stupid woman called Lolo Zadema. And those are evil children. I will make sure father regrets his actions. I will make sure they pay. Those urchins must pay. What we need now is a backup plan. Not to worry, mother. Brother, this is no time for empty threat. No. We have to bite these people in the place that it will pain them to be now. What about the setup? Like, I don't understand. What is holding it? We need more than setup here. What we need is a serious backup plan. Bad one. Not to worry, mother. I will come up with something very spectacular. Good. Prince Tobena, do not worry. I promise you, we have to make them pay. Trust me. Listen, they don't call me the man of war for nothing. This is my war. I need no help. Trust me, I know what to do. Don't worry. Trust Father. I beg you, please forgive Tobena. Listen, that Tobena is still living in this palace with us is enough indication that I am indeed a very merciful king. What he does is to constitute colossal nuisance everywhere. But I'm still tolerating him. He's still living here. That will show you that I'm indeed very lenient and very merciful. My king, Taking away the company from him will destroy him. It will make him turn into a beast. He is already a beast. That is what you don't know. Tobena has become a beast already. And if I fail to do something and tame that beast that he has become, I am afraid that one day that beast will rise and set this entire palace on fire. And I'm not going to allow that to happen. Father, he is threatening fire if the company is not giving back to him. Listen, you have to go back to him and remind him that it is only a fool that points towards his father's house with his left hand. Tobena is not just a fool, but he has become a total disappointment, not just to us in this family, but to the entire Umunono kingdom. And the time has come for me to curtail his excesses. But father... Hey, listen, hey, baby. No bets. I understand the argument you're making for your brother. I am not going to leave him empty handed with that money. No, he will have access to money. I will give him enough money every month to put his body and soul together. But what I'm doing is to get him humbled. I have taken a decision towards that direction and that decision stands. I call both of you here because there is something I want to present. Not just as the head of this family, but as the man of the house. And I need to say this into your faces. 
if there is anybody who is not comfortable with the way I have decided to run my household, I want that person to confront me now. Father, I need you to understand that for whatever decision or action you take, there must be consequences. You just allowed Father to talk. Allow him to talk. Will you shut up and let men talk? Shut up! No, 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 you, you are the person that will shut up. Because you have refused to grow up and behave responsibly like a prince. And I am going to help you. I am your father. And the onus of helping you always weighs on me and I am not shying away from that responsibility. I am going to help you. Listen to me. Prince Udoka here is now the person who is in charge of all the businesses and all the companies. If you need anything from any of the businesses, you have to pass through Udoka to get it. Father, listen, that's impossible. You can't do that to me. You can't possibly do that to me. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. You cannot sit before me and say that I cannot do what I have done already. You cannot say it is not possible because it is possible. I have done it. Now, starting from next month, you have to find somebody that you can be working for who will be paying you for you to have money to sustain yourself because you will no longer have access to any money from any of the businesses and from any of the companies. What? Me, Prince Tobena, man of war, I can never work for someone. No, I can never work for anybody. Uh, it will never happen. That will be on the condition that you are going to prove us wrong and make us understand that all these years you were sitting on a mountain of money running a multi-million dollar company that you are saving money somewhere that you can easily go and withdraw for your upkeeps. If there is no such place where you can withdraw money for your upkeeps, then you are going to find the person that you'll be working for because you can no longer assess any money from any of my businesses. No, father, you're not making sense. No, you're not making sense. You are trying my patience. No! Listen, only only clear glad on me for two. No! I will destroy this palace. You don't! Shut up, your mother, and, and, and keep quiet. Shut up, Utobena. What's wrong with you? Huh? A man that pays respect to the great paves his own way to his own greatness. I can see you are headed for destruction, Utobena. What is wrong with you? Udoka, Udoka, please don't bother yourself trying to talk some sense into this one who is already senseless. There's no problem. Don't bother yourself. But Tobena, let me tell you, I now want to see your Danya and have a sword cell. But you are going to provoke me that day that it will, it will come for me to decide to heed this your blindness, this sickness in your eyes. Are you, will you bet me? Yes, yes, yes. Will you bet me? Are you sure you people are ready? Are you sure you people are ready for what will come after this? Are you people, like, are you ready for what will come after this? Because it will never happen. You can't cut me off. Am I not your blood? The one giving me this. What is wrong with you? Huh? A stream can never rise above its source. But to me that we are tired of your ranting. I think I'm guy. Keep quiet. Oh, hey, hey! Listen. 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 Father. It's impossible. I didn't do it. You have to believe me, please. Father, the maiden is his girlfriend. There is no way he would have raped her. Can't you understand? 
I mean, truth be told, this whole thing is really confusing to me. Our former is a maiden of this land who has always been all over my brother. So, how can he possibly rape her? Joy, thank you. Thank you for believing me, thank you. But Father, please. Father, I'm innocent. Father, I can't do something like this. I can never do this. Father, this is not me. You know me. Father, I can't do this, please. This is serious. Prince Udo, why am I even calling you a prince? Ordinary Udoka, sipping a cheap brandy on a hot afternoon. This is serious. Please, just leave me alone. I need money. I need it to transform money into my account immediately. Write down the amount you need. Oh, and what you want to do with it? Are you stupid? Are you sick? Who are you to order me around? A rapist like you. Have you forgotten you're a rapist? Huh? A rapist like you has no right to tell me how to spend my father's money. Call me a rapist one more time. And I will turn you to shreds. But that's what you are. You are a bloody rapist. Yes. You lost your dignity, respect, and value the moment you were caught trying to tear that maiden's clothes. I was accused wrongly. And believe me, as far as I have not thought anything evil about any man, my chief will fight for me. Spare me that rubbish. Pretenders do the worst. Very soon, I promise, very, very soon, the whole world will see you for who you are. You and your useless sisters must, I repeat, must leave this palace. Lest I forget, I need 700,000 Naira for evening doings. If I don't see that money in my account in the next few minutes, I'm gonna get you a come along. Yeah. We make everybody they mad. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting own madness. So I, so why you they show yourself? Baby, you this is killing me. So why you they show yourself? Baby, talk to me. Why are you doing this to me? Talk to me, please. I have not done anything wrong to you. Tell me. Why to do that, please? If I have ever done anything to you, I'm sorry, please. But you can't be doing this to me now. Eh? Huh? Sudoka, please leave. Please, just go. Maybe I have to go and tell them the truth. This will destroy me. This will destroy everything I have built. Baby, look at me. Look at me. Did anybody threaten you? Baby, please. Why are you doing this to me? Why? It's... Talk to me, why? Talk to me! Just go, please. Go. Baby, you promised me that you're going to be there for me. You promised me that you loved me. Baby, you said you're going to be there by my side. You said you're never going to disappoint me. Then why are you doing this? You are killing me, please. Stop doing this. This is not Just go. My husband, please. Udoka, our son, is innocent. Don't allow the people to disgrace him and rip him of his position. Please. Uh, do you really think that this is easy on me? I am helpless right now. Can't you see? No, my husband. The lion of Fumunano Kingdom cannot be helpless. Please do something. Listen. 
I am a man in the position of authority. I am the king of Umunono Kingdom. People look up to me. There is no way I can cover crime or shield somebody from being punished when the person has violated the rules. But my that is what happened here, and I want you to understand that there is nothing I can do. But my husband, I know Udoka very well. He is innocent. He cannot hurt anyone. He did not do it. Please help him. Because... Sorry for throwing you out the other time. It was out of anger and confusion. I'm sorry. See, please, forgive my brother. We will make sure he does not repeat that nonsense with you again. Okay? Yes, my beautiful and elegant wife. The future queen of this great kingdom. Please forgive my brother. I still don't understand why you called me here. Just say it. Alright, straight to the point. I want you to help me do something. And I swear by the throne, if you do what I want, I will never leave you. What do you want? We want you to tell a very small lie to save a situation. What lie? And what situation? Tell the king and his council that Prince Udoka raped and threatened you. Excuse me. See, it is fine, my dear. Just tell them that that was why you did not come to the palace all this while. That you decided to speak out now because you found out that you're not the only one involved in it. Just small lie. <clears throat> Two million naira, and I'm in. Hey. I thought you would do this for the sake of love. My friends, you know I love you. But once beaten, to because you found out that you're not the only one involved in it. Just small lie. <clears throat> Two million naira, and I'm in. I thought you would do this for the sake of love. My friends, you know I love you. But once beaten, twice shy. So pay me if you want me to do your job. One million naira or no deal. Fine. How do I get my money? Then why not execute the job and then you get paid? I get my money and I do your job. I see. Relax. One million naira can never be a problem around here. Smart girl. <laughs> Ibube, I am so glad you're wiser now. Keep the good work up. And I will reward you when this is all over. And. I'm so glad that you understand that we're the only family you have now. Hmm? I don't need your reward now. Just know that you forced me into doing whatever I am doing. I can never be like you, nor your children. What? To me down, Mama. You think you're better than us? For concealing the truth, you're even worse than us. If you like, slap me from now till next year. I will always stand by the truth. Sit yourself, fool. You think you're better than us, Sally?
We all know the punishment due a rapist in this land. And there is no exception. Therefore, we thereby strip Prince Udoka of all his entitlement and privileges as the crown prince of this land. My king, and you leave us no choice than to hand him over to the police so that justice could take his course. My king, do you have anything to say? Let us it. He is innocent. Mm -hmm. He did not do it. It was a setup. What are you talking about? It's true, my king. What? I was made to lie that he raped me. Eh? You were paid to lie that he raped you. <laughs> you were paid by who? Please. What I told you. But I told you that I was innocent. Ijoma, Ogum, I said it. Now the girls, they have vindicated me. Um, Udoka, my son, I knew you were innocent. You all are my children, and I know what you're capable of. Honestly, I can't believe this whole thing is finally over. Oh, God. So these people can go to this land just to destroy us. This is shocking. Really shocking. No one is to be trusted anymore. If anyone had told me that Afuma could go to this land to betray me because of money, money, something that I can give to her anytime, any day. Udo, remember they threatened her family. And so what? She knew the gravity of rape accusation in yes, this land. Mommy. She was so selfish. It wasn't enough. Sit down. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for allowing you go through those trauma just to protect my family. Ebube, please get up, my dear. Get up. Ebube, you did what you could have done at the moment. I do not hold it against you. Hmm? Please, just sit down, please. Ebube, don't worry yourself. Please sit down. The most important thing is that you summoned courage and did the right thing. I promise you that you will not regret it. Have yes. a seat. Thanks, Ebube. Thank you. You're the best sister in this whole world. Oh, and I am. Ah, oh, you both are the best sisters in this <laughs> world. Mommy, I'm just joking. I know. Okay. I should... It's unbelievable. I can't believe that useless sister of mine did this to me. Ebube will suffer for the rest of her life. Brother. Yes, she will suffer for the rest of her life oh. for doing this. What we should be thinking about right now is how to get out of this mess because we are in big trouble. Exactly. See, father is not going to take this lightly with us at all. If he does not send us to jail for this, we are lucky. I know father, he hardly forgives that mother. He might not send us to jail, but the punishment we will receive will be worse than going to jail. I must find a way to solve this problem. I will kill that girl that calls herself my daughter. What is the meaning of this? Please, we don't need this right now. We all have to ask Father for his forgiveness before he does something terrible to us. We need to settle down and plan on what we are going to tell him. See, Mother, we all just have to look for an escape route. This is no time for this, so. The Lord knows I cannot afford to spend the rest of, of my beautiful life in jail. It's not going to happen. My king, please, I am sorry. It was the work of the devil. It won't happen again, please. What useless devil? I mean, why are you bringing the devil into this? Why? We were foolish. Please do not use our foolishness against us. We are sorry. Father, please. We did not do all that with our clear minds. We are your children. Please forgive us, Father. 
please. I planned it all. Punish me and leave them out of this. It's all my fault. My king, please don't listen to him. Please, punish me instead and leave my children out of this. It, 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 it's all my doing, please. Please, father, I cost it all. I'm the one who did it. I'm very sorry, Father. Please forgive me. Father, please don't go. Father, Father, please. Come on, Father, I dare go away. Please, my love, please. I was scared of my brother going to jail. Please. I did not do it for the money. Please forgive me. So I am the one I'm supposed to be in jail. Is that what you're saying? I was told that the king will protect you. That you never go to prison. And you will never lose anything. I keep it left them. Are you a fool? My love, please. Forgive me. Please, my love. I begged you to tell me what was going on back there. I begged you to trust me. I thought that what you did was going to destroy me. So what did you do? I was so scared. I was scared, my love. I thought I was doing the best thing at that time, please. Did you know what you did to me? Did you know what I passed through all because of you? My heart was shattered by the person I love and trusted. I'm so sorry. Please, my love, please. I, I couldn't do anything. I, I, couldn't, I, I couldn't just do anything. Please forgive me, please. I forgave you a long time ago. My love, my love. Betrays a man that truly really loves her. No woman does that. I don't have much to say to you, if not for you to take your miserable self out of this palace right now. And if you dare try to defy my orders, I will leave a mark on your face that it will be very, very difficult for you to ever get married in this life. Get out! I know you men to be very useless, always going back to your vomits. But you see this thing that just left here? She's gone forever. If you make a little mystic of trying to reconcile with her, then you will find out that you have a warrior as a sister. Excuse me. She is strong and she is brave. Like a lion, she is bold and fear no man. She fears no man. She's a woman of peace, but no. I am not happy. The punishment my father gave me is affecting me mentally, emotionally, and psychologically. 
Allo Mel, can I How dare you? Now listen and listen very attentively. If the lizard of the house refuses to behave like the lizard of the house, it will be treated like the lizard of the farmland. Tobena, I will start treating you like a mad stranger because it's obvious we are not related. My friend, will you shut up and keep quiet? Do you realize you're talking to Prince to Tobena? To praise my foot! What nonsense is that? This is just the beginning. A child that says the mother will not sleep will not also sleep as well. You think you're the only one mad? That we all are packaging our madness does not necessarily mean that we do not have atom of madness in our body. And only a fool will take a man's meekness for weakness. Don't dare me. What will you do? Stay away from me. Or what? You will feel the fury of a ruthless man. And I shall send you to your roof. You are not my match. I will waste you. Read my lips. I will waste you. Tobena. You are just like a sesa fly moving around the scrotum and I shall handle you and put you back where you truly belong. Let me tell you what you don't know. You can go around the pepper tree, but you can never climb it. <laughs> Ijoma, be careful. Enugu ne enugu abrofu. I am unbreakable. And I'm undiluted. Ijoma, and I'm going to be careful. Honey, I'm finished. How do I get out of this mess? Can I even survive this? My love, you're making me so worried. You need to calm down and explain to me what's going on in the palace to make you this restless. The king said I should apologize to Prince Udoka. He also said I should get a job because I will start fending for myself. To crown it all, he gave me one month to leave the palace. What? Alone. Uh, apologizing is understandable. But what I don't understand is why he would ask you to start fending for yourself. I mean, what has that got to do with the issue at hand? He wants me to learn how to take responsibilities and become a real man. Oh, my baby. I'm scared because I don't even know how to survive. I have not worked all my life. And then tell him you don't want you. I mean, he can't force you to do it. He said if I disobey him, I will face the wrath of love. How do I get out of this mess? Don't worry, my love. I'll work out something. Okay? Are you sure? Yes. On the other hand, Ijoma has started again. That girl is a thorn on my flesh. She is bent on destroying my happiness. What happened? What did she do this time? I don't know. Don't worry, my love. I'll take care of this. I will. Hmm? Listen. I don't care anymore. If you don't like the way I live my life, then so be it. What are you saying? I should fold my arms and allow them terrorize my family just like that? No, I won't do that. Not even because of you. I won't. It's fine. It's fine. You can go to hell for all I care. I can't believe he could ever do a thing like this to me. What didn't I do for him? I loved him so much from my heart. I respected him. I gave him everything. And this is what he did to me. He does not deserve you. Stop crying. He's a loser. Don't allow this get to you, please. IJ, please, stop crying. Any man who makes you cry like this, does not deserve you. Yes. 
I know, but I don't want this whole thing. I just wish I could be an ordinary girl with normal problems. This whole thing is weighing me down. It is. You're the princess of Umunono land. You're not an ordinary girl. The earlier you accept who you are and face whatever that comes your way, the better for you. I don't want that anymore. I just want to run away to a place I will not be recognized. A place I won't be a princess from a trouble-filled family. I just want to live a simple life. I want to sleep and wake up without issues. This whole thing is becoming too much for me to bear. It's okay. It's okay. Don't talk like that. I know it's not easy. But running away can never solve the problem. Only cowards run away from their problem. And Ijoma, my twin says, is definitely not a coward. <laughs> It'll be funny. It's okay. Stop crying. And what is going on? I mean, why did you bring me here? In one very short sentence, I want you to tell me what you have come to do in the palace. Excuse me? <laughs> Why would you even ask me such an embarrassing question when you clearly know who I came here to see? It was never my intention to embarrass you because I still have respect for your dignity as a woman. I wouldn't also want to talk to you in presence of the workers. That is why I brought you here to dismiss you politely. <laughs> Did I hear you well? What do you mean dismiss me politely? What are you implying? Of course you heard me. Your classless boyfriend, Tobenna, is no longer qualified to receive any visitor in this palace. Ijoma, hey, listen. Whatever problem you have going on in the palace, I am definitely not a part of it. So please, don't get me involved. No, you are involved. That fool got you involved when he ruined my relationship and that of my brother. Oh yes. So he doesn't deserve to have any. Not at all. My goodness. Is this how low you can get? Hey, 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 hey. Ezine or whatever your name is called, your welcome in this palace has a Spaniard. And I want you to take your miserable self out of this place right now before I strip you naked. And I mean every word of it. Ijoma, you don't have to allow them to turn you into what you are not. You just have to let peace reign. Please, not after all they have done, mother. They asked for war. And war they shall get. They should wait for it. Ijoma, please. I am beginning to see this from a broader perspective. Let's not play into their hands. They were the ones who already played into my own hands. They made me lose it. And this time around, I shall deal with them my way. My baby, please ignore them. You don't have to lose yourself because of anyone. The worst thing that can happen to you is to lose yourself. Mommy, I have lost it already. Can't you see? These useless people made me to lose the love of my life. Ijoma, don't tell me you're still lamenting over that boy. He does not deserve you. Exactly what Ebube told her. And I agree to that. Any man that treats a woman like that does not deserve her. You're better off without him. Don't be like this because of him. He does not want it. I just hope they will respect themselves this time around. Because I wouldn't want anyone to take me for granted. Never. I did my findings and I found out something. Lolo Zodima is not even a woman of Umunono. I don't understand. But Ezo Sapwe the 15th, that's your father, was already married to your mother who already gave him three daughters. As a young man, he was not happy, but the young wife kept encouraging him that the boy child 
will still come. But he believed that a woman that already gave birth to three daughters will surely bear another female. To prevent that from happening, he visited Akalogo of Abadani, a native doctor who was vast in sacrifices. Um, Father, can you please make the story short? There is no shortcut to this story. Believe you me, it works all the time. Please continue. I'm listening. Akalugu told the king that he will have to carry a sacrificial pot to a junction where three roads meet. He assured the king that surely whatever that makes him have only female children will be carried away with a sacrifice. After the sacrifice has been prepared, the king was required to look for a virgin or a woman who has not been with the man for three years to leave the sacrifice. That was how Lolo was on the man came about. I think I need a drink to sink all this. Who cares for a drink? I'm confused. And here was I thinking promiscuity is just the thing of our time. I can't believe it was that difficult getting a woman who hasn't slept with a man for just three years. So what did my father do? Akalugo informed your father that he had a woman with an unknown background. A woman he rescued as a child where she was abandoned to die. He took her home, and that child has become a woman. And also the man is that child. Akalugo assured your father that also the man can assist with the lifting. The king agreed, and elegant also the man was called out, and she lifted the pot of sacrifice as instructed. I was shocked and surprised when the Prime Minister narrated how those slaves we call brothers and sisters came into existence. What? I was dumbfounded. Abomination. So, I've been dragging my own husband with a common slave. I want to hear the complete story because I cannot wait to personally chase those things out of this palace. It's a long story for another day. But the bitter truth is, they are slaves and they don't belong here. This is unbelievable. Really? We are going to use this story to plan against them. They have to leave. They don't have resident permits. Hari Raduro, I have been saying this. Enubuku ne enubungu abrofo. They are not the slaves, and they have been chilling in the palace. Can you imagine? Hello, man. This is unbelievable. I was saying this. Uh, exactly. Uh, I heard this into the logs. If I want to add to the home. <laughs> Nering her is not a problem uh, at all. It is not. Yes, I am just waiting for her to clear the load. You know, as an intelligent man, once she clears, clears the road, eh? I take over. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay. Count on me. <laughs> I'm a mess. 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 What is going on? Huh? I knew I I knew it. I knew it. 
I knew somebody was monitoring me. Yeah, no, I'm good. I'm good at monitoring. Oh, 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 oh. Just that I wanted to be sure. Now I've seen it. You have been sending information about me to his in the air? Eh? No. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Who, who are you? You are sending information about me. I'm sorry. 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 i am sorry 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 i Starting from today, eh? you will only be my ear. You will bring information about this in to me. And whatever I tell you is what you will tell her. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Because he will be able to do it. What you have to do? What you have to do? I'm sorry, sir. I will, I will finish your family. It will be able I'm sorry, sir. It will not happen again. Solely for yourself. Yes, sir. You sent for me, my prince. Where are the car keys in the house? Prince Tobina took all the car keys. What? And where is he? I don't know. What seems to be the problem? Um, can I borrow your car, please? Why? What happened to all your cars? And even the company car? It seems your brother smoked a very special kind of weed today. He collected all the car keys. Hmm. So you want mine? No, I won't give you. I'm going straight to him to collect your car keys. Wait, 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 wait. wait. I'll, I will just do that. Don't worry, no need. Good. Good. We make everybody the grace. Shena, you design the strategy. We make everybody the money. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. I left you all with my car keys. You mean my father's car keys? Hmm? To be now. Hand me the car keys. To avoid trouble. You are a slave. And slaves don't drive cars. They trek and walk in the farm. Tobina, watch your mouth. Mind what you say to my brother. Shuma, it's okay. Um, Mr. Man, I am running late for work. I do not have time for your stupidity. So hand me the car keys now. I said I will not hand you the car keys. And always rephrase, my father's car keys. You are a slave. The earlier you understand that and know your place in this palace, the better for you. Tobinna, don't be stupid. I own your ass right now. No. You have a huge disadvantage and I am capitalizing on that. You are at my mercy. You are a slave. And what is he blabbing about? I am blabbing about the fact that you and your useless siblings are slaves. What nonsense are you talking about? Tobena, hand me the car keys. Tobena, hand him over his car keys or be ready to be handed over to a doctor. <laughs> you know what? All right, I'm sorry. I don't want you to look as if I'm the one breaking bad news, but truth be told, ask your mother a simple question. Tell her to explain your roof. Yes. I, I can see you've changed your dealer. I advise you to stick to the previous one because we were, you were better off. Now listen and listen real good, you confused moron. My father, the king, might be merciful to accommodate slaves in this palace, but the entire people of Fomunono will not tolerate that. You are a slave and you will never rule. Read my lips. You are a slave and you will never rule. You did that during one hour walk. Yes. You are a slave. Yes, what is it? What is it you want to discuss with me that you cannot open in my chamber? 
Why did you ask me to meet you here? And your faces? Why are you looking this way? Is there a problem? Who is our father? Yes. Tell us the truth. Who is our father? What kind of useless question are you asking? I mean, where is this coming from? We need to know the truth. Tell us. Who is our father? Well, I am your father. I am your biological father. Do you have any problem with that? Tobena called us slaves. What? He said we should confirm from you and mother. He sounded so convincing. So we want to know the truth, father. Are you really our father? Tobena said what? Yes, father. Please be honest with us. You can handle the truth. Who is our father? Tobena. Tobena. So, this is true. We are actually slaves. We are not your children. Father! They do this to us for God's sake. Why? You all believe a story that is not even well told. How is it possible you are slaves? How? Maybe father is not our father. The way Tobina sounded, it seems mother had us before he married her. Oh. Can you hear yourself? You are not even sure. You better go and ask your mother first before jumping into conclusion. What is wrong with you, Tobena? Does it mean you are mad or something? Father, I am not mad and nothing is wrong with me. Wait, listen to me, Tobena. I have had enough of your stupidity and the time has come for you to leave this palace for good. Father, you can't do that. You, you cannot tell me that I can't do that because I'm doing that already. I am not going to sit back and watch you destroy the things I labeled over the years to put together. In my case, you check where you go. Father, with all due respect, I am going nowhere. This is my father's house. For that reason, I will not move an inch. It is Udoka and his useless sisters that will leave this palace. Hey, let, let, let me tell you something. To Oh, cool, I'm not a on your The okra can never grow taller than the owner who planted it. I am telling you now that I've taken the decision as the man of this family, and that decision stands. Gather all your things that you can gather that belongs to you in this palace. Because as soon as I am done settling this trouble that you just started in this palace, you are leaving. Dubenna, he shall learn GMO if one Mother, thank God that you are here. We seriously need to talk. About what? Mother, why didn't you tell us? How could you do this to us? Why? What are you talking about, Ogum? That at least told us that the king is not our father. What? We have the right to know. You are joking, right? Where is this coming from? And who told you that? Doesn't really matter who said it. Does it? My goodness. This is really unfair, mother. I mean, this is, this is not right. Oh, I don't know who told you that. Neither do I understand where all this is coming from. The king is your father. Mother, don't lie to us. The king could not look us in the face when we confronted him with the question. He couldn't deny it, mother. Don't, so don't lie to me. Don't even lie to us. Tobena already told us the truth. Please don't. Oh, I knew it. So this is where all this is coming from. No, this is the height of it. I will not take this from anyone. No, never. I can't believe this. We are about to lose everything. 
everything. Ah, oh my goodness. It is very glaring that mommy doesn't want to tell us the truth. She's hiding a lot from us. Oh, I wish I could just wake up from this nightmare. Oh my goodness. What wrong have I done to you and your children? Why do you hate me so much to the extent of transferring your hatred to my children? Why? You are disturbing my peace. Leave this place this minute. Else I ask the guards to throw you out. I have done nothing but to show you love. Even when you made it very difficult for me to do so. Why are you head bent on seeing my children and I unhappy? Why? I will never be happy. Until you and your children leave this palace. This palace is big enough to contain all of us. We are not dragging anything, are we? We are! We are dragging something. You will know no peace, I said, until you and those your stupid children leave this palace. Is it difficult for you to understand? This is my husband's house. My children and I belong here. So let's live in peace. And please, tell your son to stop calling my children slaves. That's what you are. Slaves! That is what you are! Anyway, there's no problem. When my son becomes the king, you and those your stupid children will be thrown out of this palace! Now get out of my presence, this minute! I said get out! Get out! Udoka, I am holding this meeting with you because I have this feeling you will understand me as a man better than women. I may be right and I may be wrong, but I am pleading with you to try as much as possible. And make me right. Yes. It is true that your mother does not know where she came from. But that does not mean you are slaves. You and your sisters. You are the fruits of my youth. I was the first man. And the only man who has experienced the woman in your mother. You are no slaves. Father, this, this whole thing is not just sinking in. Listen, you have to find a way and let it sink. I... I want to put it mildly. Your mother lost her virginity to me. I married her properly. From the greater Kalugu family. In line with the marital laws of Omono. I am still married to her and I will remain married to her until death do us part. So Father, you are saying that we are not slaves. Exactly. But we are your biological children. Exactly. Then why will you to be calling us slaves? He even asked us to ask you and mother. Why? Udoka, that is the reason we are holding this meeting. Like I said when I started. You see, at that point in my life when I was in dire need of a male child, I approached Akalug Wezedibia. And there was this sacrifice he prepared for me that required that a virgin girl should carry it to a particular junction. Where we cannot find a virgin girl, we needed a woman who has not been with a man for three years. That was how your mother came into the picture. She was that virgin girl that assisted me with that sacrifice. And something happened. I don't want to explain it because I know you will understand it as a man. And then she became pregnant. And uh, she ended up here as my wife. The rest of you know. 
I married that woman. She is my wife. I already pronounced her my wife. So I wouldn't know why anybody will tell you that you are a slave and you are listening to the person. And I want this explanation to put rest to this nonsense rumor that is making the rounds in this palace. Don't allow anybody to make you feel bad on the account of what is not founded. You and your sisters are not slaves. The end of the story is that the king was consumed by Uzodima's beauty. So he begged her with everything in him to let him test the woman in her. She agreed and the king took her to a hotel and this virgin. After a while, the native doctor told the king that she's pregnant and it's a baby boy. The king now decided to marry her. That was how the king married a slave into the palace. But that does not make them slaves. Their mother might have been a slave, but she is now married to the king, so they are not slaves. When you shut that thing you called mouth, what is wrong with you, Ebube? Are you losing it? Ebube, you are a fool. Yes, in fact, you make more sense when you are not talking. Why are you finding it difficult to see and understand that these people are our enemies? And for that reason, we should treat them like enemies. If you ask me, I'll just say we should ignore it, baby. She's just being silly. What we should be talking about right now is how to use this against them, not this one. Don't worry about that. I know what to do. The throne rather moves to another family. Yes. I rather move this throne to another family than Doka rule over me. We have to do everything within our power to make sure that they do not rise above us. Good. Enuguku, Nenugungo, Abunusu. I would speech from my senseless kid sister who has refused to think like a human being. You know, Ebube, we are all ashamed of you. When will you learn to know that family, family comes first? When? Do the right thing. We are one family. Oh, shut up before I shut it for you. You know, it's been a long time I last slapped you. If you provoke me, I will slap your teeth and they will fall off. Listen, let me tell you. We had counted you out of us a long time ago. So stop telling us about the right thing. You are a fool. I just know now, you're a big fool. God knows I'm not a fool. Annabelle and I were discussing something this morning and so we finally decided to bring it forward for more discussion. I am listening. Just that I must warn. You must not say anything that will make me angry. Uh, just like what you did the other time. Nakami eh? Buru. Yes. You've worked with me closely over the years. Eh? I don't know Mama Fuma. So go ahead. Boss. We are aware of all the happenings around us. The politics in Omonono Kingdom. And how we can benefit from this scheme. We are ready to work for you. But you are not carrying us along. Is there anything we are not doing right? Uh, that's a very intelligent question. And you 
What is going on here? What gods? What insurance is in there? You bashed into my mansion unannounced. I beg, make a hear what? No matter how hot your temper is, it no go feed boy rice. I'll leave my compound now before I pour it like this rice you mentioned. No, they show yourself, oh. No triumph. We not say you be doubt, yes, but that one no means say they fear you. Now me on streets. Isn't it? Yes. You called me a doubt, Nime Uh huh. Listen to me. Say that if Dr. Gorodon does not mean the gods will speak English. I am still Ago, the fearless lion of the jungle. If my uncle, my elder don't say, forget to buy package in the hand after all. I beg! Listen to me, forget if you are in will go and deal with you. Even the, the evil spirits will reject your cops. Mm. If you like bath monkey, wear a suit, carry and go to London, he go see disgrace instead when he see banana. Look at you. It is how they fear you. No, for your mind now you don't arrive. Abu. You be doubt, we don't agree. As in the eagle, I won't doubt in I, my house. I, not doubt, you be. You can't do anything. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Can you just say it? What do you want? Now you're talking. Sit down. I need your help. We need to remove Prince Sudoka out of the way. She needs my help. Look. I believe we can work together to achieve our goal. Let's put our differences aside. Good. Go ahead. So, how do you plan to go about it? I did some digging. I found out that two years ago, 150 million naira was missing from our community funds, which Udoka covered up. I want to know how he used the money, what he used it for, and how the money can implicate him. I would need your help on that. Hmm. So the innocent is also guilty. <laughs> so tell me, why Prince Udoka? Operation destroyed the goose that lays the golden egg. I see. So after then what? The royal house will be left with no other option than to give up. I believe the king will never allow Prince Tobina to become king. You know what you will do? Hmm? You will bring all the necessary information to me. And uh, I will give you feedback as soon as possible. Very well then. I'll get them across to you tomorrow. Okay. Thank you. You have to be careful about this. We can't accuse Prince Udoka without a tangible evidence. Don't worry, Father. We've got strong evidence against him from those who helped him cover his track. Oh yes, they are even willing to testify against him in court. Wow. <laughs> who can believe the Prince Udoka can carry out such an act? Exactly my sentiment. I was just as shocked as you are. Would not only disqualify him or being held to the throne, but also land him in jail. I pity the poor boy. He doesn't know what's coming. I hope we are making sure no one knows that I'm involved in this. Oh, Father, don't you trust me again? I got you covered. Very well then. Um, one more thing. Mm. You have to make sure you're very careful with that boy, Ago. Mm -hmm. You can only take a child out of the street, but you cannot take the street out of a child. Don't worry, Father. I know exactly how to handle Ago. Uh. Boss, our initial plan was to destroy Ezine and her father. You even threatened me because of her. Why is it that lately you associate yourself as if she's the one with need? Wait, boss. Are you trying to say you don't trust Ezine? Listen to me, my wonderful girls. There is something I want to tell you. You see, life is a jungle. You don't have a permanent enemy. 
or a permanent friend. Hmm? Relax. She will soon be here. I will handle everything myself. So, you said you had good news. Yes. When you go through this file, you will find out in the documents that actually, like you said, 150 million naira was uh, mapped out for the construction of a load, but it was never accounted for. Interesting. So, was it stated that Udoka was the one who charged the contract then? Well, the contract was handed over to the loyal family, but the king was not involved. Prince Udoka has always been the one handling everything that comes to the palace. Hmm. Which means this can dent him in the eyes of the people and he is going to lose everything. Of course. <laughs> no one is innocent after all. It serves him light. Even the innocent is guilty. It baffles me how people love us with their pen. And when we cry, they chase after us. They want to kill us, eh? For crying out. Naginime. It surprises me that they walk freely on the road and people he places on them. Exactly. Stealing with a biro is even more deadly. I mean, I'm not in support of any. But it's high time we did something about those in high places, robbing us of our futures and presents. And also the past. Because they steal our destinies. Yeah. That's funny, but you have a point. <laughs> I'll go. Thank you for this. You're welcome. <sighs> With this, Prince Udoka will not only lose the throne, he may also run out of this land and never to return. How did you get this? doesn't matter how I got it. Answer my question. How did you get this? Well, I got it with the help of a friend of mine. I needed to make sure that Prince Udoka doesn't take what is rightfully yours. I had to nail him at all costs. So then I got a friend of mine to dig into him and he was able to come up with this. But my love, you don't look very happy. Am I supposed to be happy? Didn't you cross check it? Look at my signatures everywhere. I was the one that handled this contract. If this thing goes out, I am finished. Oh no. I, how could I not have... Who else knows about this? Um, um, just my friend and I. Do you trust that your friend? Of course. I, I don't keep friends I can't trust. Please. If this thing goes out, I'm finished. My love, do not worry. I'll put an end to this immediately. Are you sure you can handle this? Of course I can. You've Please got do. to trust me. Please do. Jenna, you design the strategy. We make everybody they mad. Please don't get Remember, it. every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting own madness. So I, so why you they show yourself? I'll be we go for you. Your son, Tobena, is going around this kingdom telling men and women in positions of authority that your son, Udoka, is a slave. This is a very strong accusation. And as the one you have named the crown prince, you should deal with it. Tobena is not the crown prince. Of course, I know my king. All I am saying is that as he's moving around, then to the image of your crown prince, you should deal with it. The people must know the circumstances surrounding the birth of Udok. Yes, it is true that I don't know where my wife, Lord Luzodema, came from. Yes, that is true. But I married her as king. I already named her my wife. I married her from the same family that gave her life. 
the same family she sees as her family and the same family that already accepted her as one of their own. Now, why will anybody read useless meaning into that? Sometimes I feel we will never come to the end of this trouble. We are the ones creating the trouble ourselves. How? Can't we see the actions are beginning to create impact on us? Especially with the girls. Uh, um, Ebube, if you do not have something meaningful to say, then it is best you shut up, like shut your mouth. That is it. We all know the roots to the troubles in this palace. Let's face it squarely. Don't let me channel my energy on you. You will not ah, like it. What is your problem? And where is that cursed son of yours? Give me one thing that won't kill you to the rest. What is it? What did he do this time around? Please calm down. You are Please asking me down. what he has done? I should calm down. Please calm down, my king. And where is your brother? My king, I have no idea. You have no idea? Would you have seen your brother? Father, I have not seen him since today. Nobody has seen him. You don't know where he is. No way. What do we do now? What are we going to do? We are not going to do anything. We will all die in this palace. Toby, Toby, if you value your life, run now and never come back. What is this one saying? Zada Walsa. Toby, now, nah. Father is looking for you with a gun. And from what I saw, he will kill you. If he doesn't kill you today, nobody will kill you again. Run! My father stole my gun. Run! Father! Come on. Come on. Prime Minister, this is wrong. It's an abomination for us to sit back, hold our hands, and watch a ruthless woman with unknown background bear us king. Are they me? It's wrong. My prince, you have a point there. But this is not a decision I alone can make. I have to consult my council of chiefs. My Prime Minister, you are influential. People listen to you. It's time to use your influence on them. Please, I promise to reward you handsomely. Do this for me. Um, don't worry yourself about the reward. My interest in this land is to make sure that our land is better and I will do everything possible to achieve that. That I assure you. Please do. Please do. I'm counting on you, my Prime Minister. I need to take my leave. Very well, then um, send me well to the king. He will hear. Isn't it? You have been rejecting my calls. You have been avoiding me. I hope it is not what I'm thinking. I'll go. There's a lot of things going on at the moment you won't understand. I will explain them to you later. Please. What do you want me to understand, isn't it? Eh? The world will be a midwit witness, you. I was on my own when you came. I was on my own. You were your two left legs, Ibata. And now you want to keep me in the dark. Agu, please. Look this is not the time for all this. Just bear with me for now. I know I don't have senses. I know I did not go to school. Oh. That I don't have university certificates. Manage me go, it's money. If you pray with me, eh? You will move go. Amen, girl. Agu, there will be no need for all that. Like I said, I will explain to you in due time. But then you have to bear with me for now, please. But it is important that I warn you. I, it is important I warn you before time. You gotta go, because anybody that brings home uh, an ant infested firewood should not be surprised when lizard come visiting. I I excuse me, I've had enough of your nonsense. Stop blabbing. Listen, the fact I'm being calm does not mean I'm a coward. I'm not afraid of you, just so we are clear. This you is don't scare. Listen, I'm still talking. You don't scare me. 
If you really want to wage war, go ahead. Be rest assured, I will kill you in that war. Ah. Yes. Yes. Yes, deal with it. I strike when it is hot. Mm. And I don't miss my target. My friend, get out. You don't scare me. Isn't it? Telly days. I am giving you telly days to give me a feedback. It was here. Me, Maria. You're so pathetic. Get out! Oh, come see that. I'm not going to Oh, say it, yeah. It's a bamboo. You are joking with Dago, the fierce riot. Idiot. I don't blame you. You came to threaten Ezine. Idiot. Father. Father, I want to thank you for having so much faith in me. For standing by me even when it was very difficult for you. Thank you so much. I appreciate. And I promise you, I will never let you down. Udoka, you are not just a good son. You have become a good man. And a good man must always be rewarded for his goodness. So I wanted to see what happened. That's my way of saying thank you for being a good man. Father, I also want to use this medium to applaud you for taking in a woman, even when you know nothing about her background, loving her and caring for her. Father, thank you so much. We all appreciate. Thank you. Udoka, I love your mother so much. In fact, I can confirm to you authoritatively that she remains the best thing that happened to me. Father, that God that gave you such heart to take in a woman even without knowing her background will never allow shame to overtake you, Father. You see? But I want to beg you for something. What is it? Father, it's about to bend now. Father, I want you to find a place in your heart and forgive him. Father, you know he mostly acts before he thinks. Please, Father, forgive him, please. Okay, you don't have to bother yourself about that. To be nice, is my son. Just like you are my son. I have forgiven him already. Not as if I have any choice anyway. But I have forgiven him. So you may go to him and tell him that I said so. Okay, Father. Thank you so much, Father. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. Calling your lines. Yeah? What happened? You don't been picking your calls. I was cooling off in a hotel. I needed dad to calm down, so I gave him space. Hmm. It's alright. I'm so glad you're back home. Thank you very much. Thank you. Where is Ebube? Ebube. <laughs> Where else? That girl. She's with the enemies. Excuse me. She's where? You heard me. With the enemies. Call her. You see, brother, sometimes I get so fed up of her attitude. And I begin to wonder why she's like that. From the way you pamper her, Bube, it's obvious you love her. But this time around, permit me to treat her for cop. Go ahead, brother. I'm tired of her already. Hey! Walk fast! Stupid hey! girl! Hey! You are back! What did you do? Come here. Don't make me look at Where are you coming from? I 
I um I I was I went to see Ogum. You went to see who? Are you mad? So after all my warnings, what are you doing in our enemy's quarters? No, tell me, what are you doing in our enemy's quarters? That's a very good brain resetting slap. You slapped me. And I will behead you the next time I see you dining and whining with my enemies. Do you understand? If I see you anywhere around those witches and wizards again, I will behead you. Stupid girl. This is just a warning. Let us see you an inch near that wing. We will skin you alive. Fool. Now, Zeus out. Get out. She's still here. Are you stupid? My friend will be get out of here. Stop up, boys. Get out! It's okay, my princess. Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. What happened? <laughs> Prince Tovina slapped her. What? Why? I don't know. If you talk to me, what happened? Okay. <laughs> talk to me. What happened? Why did he slap you? <laughs> because I came to your quarter. He slapped me and he said I should never come there again. He slapped you because he came to my quarters. Is he mad? Coward. Where is that coward? My prison. Where is that coward in the lost most once he steps his foot into this palace? I love this. I missed homemade food. Can you imagine? Just two days you are at the hotel. You already complain. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know he loves food. And loves food. You're a coward. That's what you are. A very big coward to be now. Be a, be a, be a, be a. Okay. Leave this place right now before you regret it. It's only a fool that exercises power over women. Someone should tell this loser to leave my presence before I lose it. You know, Tobina, I've never heard that you fought or beat anybody outside this palace. <laughs> but each time you come home, you start showing off your muscles. I want to go, Guala! Listen, I have been tolerating your excesses in this palace because of your age as a little boy. I call it adolescent stage. But one more nonsense from you and I will show you the stuff I am wearing. That is the only thing you know how to do. Always back like a dog. What? Oh, you are even a dog. No, there's no need of it. What's hey? You are a big dog. Caucasian dog. Doka. Tobenna. Ma tagika crayfish. Doka. Tobenna. Ma tagika crayfish. What can come or down? You don't know anything. You are forgetting something. Have you forgotten I have a gun? I give it to you, man. Have you forgotten that I have a gun? Tobinna! Have you forgotten that I have a gun? Tobinna! Tobinna! I'm a fool! Tobinna, I'm back now! You better leave here before you die! You're looking for someone to kill you! Get out of this place now! Get out of this place! You want to die, right? Leave! Get out! Leave! 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 Let's be seated. Okay. What is going on? Why do we have an emergency meeting that I am not aware of? Um, Your Highness, greetings. Greetings? Um, our people say when you see a toad running in daytime, 
something must be after it. Sure. That is true. Yes, that is very true. Okay. Okay. Um, my king, we are here because an elder cannot sit at home while laboring goats deliver in Tita. Hey, listen, listen. Can you come out clear? You know, can you do less of proverbs? Why is it that elders arrived my palace for an emergency meeting without informing me beforehand? What is going on? I am so sorry, Your Highness. We are here because we are not happy. We are not comfortable with your choice of successor. We cannot allow the son of a slave woman to rule over us. And the elders in councils have met. Hey, hey, hey! You know, just hold it there. Are you confirming to me that the elders in council of Umunono actually committed the abomination of meeting secretly to discuss the succession of the king of Umunono? You are getting it twisted. No, no, I'm not getting it twisted because there was a meeting indeed. You just confirmed that. It was not a secret meeting. The meeting was held in the town hall with the executive of Umunono Progressive Union in attendance. Yes, yes. The matter was put to vote and we resolved that it is either Tobena or the kingship will have to rotate. That was what happened. What are you saying? Udoka is equally my son. Your Highness. No, no, what business do you have with the paternity of my children? You want to hold a meeting for, for that? Your Highness. We didn't discuss the paternity of your children in that meeting because that is not our business. Your Highness, we have always seen Lolo Zodima as a daughter of Akalugo, Ezedibia. Finally, we have the confirmation that she was a child already sacrificed to unknown powers before she was rescued. And the descendant of such a woman cannot rule over any people. That is the decision of men in council. That's, that is it. That is our stand. How can I allow a character like Tobena rule as king? In a Monono Kingdom, that would be disastrous. That would be worse than war. I can't allow that. But I am not going to allow royalty to depart from this household. What do I do? Like I said, we found out that Prince Tobena was the one who handled the contract and not Prince Odoka. So there was no need carrying on further. Says who? Huh? Isn't this says who? I mean, Agu. Prince Odoka is the one we are trying to remove out of the picture and not Prince Tobena. So you can't just... So good. So what? So, so good. Eh? Isn't it? Have you ever seen where somebody invested in a business and not cash out? Anababa? I don't get it. Do you know how much I spent to get that information? But then it's of no use to us anymore, Agu. We don't need it, Agu. We have to move on to something else. I am not moving. Mba, my move was do some, just to put some of my brisk, my, uh, look up my bus stop. Can you believe that, Eh? I am a businessman. I will not move until I cast out on my first investment. Okay, today. Agu, it's up to you if you don't want to move past it. But then I've moved past that. As in the rest of me, tell you something. I don't mean to now. I said things the way it is. Gente, first thing tomorrow morning, that document will be on Omo or daily. It will be published. And I will follow it up. Agu, please. You cannot do that. I mean, that is not part of the deal. As in the, I never had a deal with you. I never had a deal with you. Don't provoke me. I never had a deal with you. Listen to me. Tell the police to be now to provide my 20 million naira. Adam E.G. Collins Let him provide my 20 million naira. Else, I call me a cuckoo. 
I'm a very ruthless businessman. My 20 million. 20 million nylam. Kunu jagu samegu. Nekono. Nense. Oh my God. It is so frustrating doing business with an illiterate. What do I do? What do I do? He's in a thing. What do I do? What do I do? A tout will always be a tout. I told you to be careful with him. I know, Father, I know. That was not the plan. I mean, I don't even want Tobina to find out about him. Because he will suspect something. Do you think I want this? Then let him know what is on ground. Oh, Father. Oh, do you have 20 million naira to give Ago? And Agu is a very mean human. If that document should leak, my goodness, that's it. Tobina will never trust me again. Then tell him about it. Let him pay him off. Oh, Father. I'll think about it. Meanwhile, how was the meeting? Did the king agree to make Tobina his successor? The king is a wise man. He will never allow Tobena to be king. He will rather give in to rotation. But you can never be too sure, father. What if he actually makes Tobena his successor? What are we going to do? Then we will make him unfit for the throne. You can trust me in that. My prime minister, I am here to thank you, to appreciate you for fighting for me. Once again, thank you very much for fighting for me. You're welcome, uh, Prince Tobin. Like I said the other day, what I am doing, I don't do it for anybody. I do for the good of the land. I want the best for our land. That makes you a good man, and we all appreciate you. I want to make you understand that I will forever be loyal to you. Come on, you should know that as the future king of our land. Your loyalty should be with the people and not me. <laughs> you are right, my Prime Minister. My loyalty should be with the people. Yes, but that doesn't stop me from thanking you for what you did. Yes, and I promise to be loyal to our people. But having said that, I came with this. I appreciate you and say thanks for being a good man. Prince Tobena, that is what I always do. Setting good example for everyone. I want the best for our land. I never do it expecting anything in return. My Prime Minister, thanks for setting good examples. Yes. I know you are not expecting anything in return, but this is just to appreciate you for being a good man. So please. Just accept this. You don't understand what I mean, Prince Dobena. I'm not doing the right thing, expecting anything from anybody. It is God who rewards good deeds. Tobena, we have a problem. A very big one at that. The friend I told you about is threatening to take those documents to the press if we don't pay him the sum of 20 million naira. Excuse me. 20 what? I thought you said you trusted your friend. I know. I did think I could trust him, but then it appears no one is to be trusted nowadays. Listen, listen, this joke is expensive. If that document goes out, I am finished. Don't you understand? Exactly why you should pay him the money. Where do you expect me to get such a month from? 20 million naira. Have you forgotten my situation? Then what are we going to do? 
As you can see, this is clearly beyond me. You should have thought about all this before investigating this matter. Oh, you please, should have. Please. This is no time for blames. How was I supposed to know your father allows you to handle such huge projects? You were the same person who told me that your father hates you, that he gives everything to your brother. Okay, listen. Can you borrow me that money? Borrow me 20 million, I promise to pay back. Tobin, I don't have that kind of money right now. Besides, what really did you do with a whooping sum of 150 million naira? Come on, is in there? Don't even go there. Have you forgotten? There are almost 80 new clubs in town, and I, Tobenna, the man of war, have been exploring those new clubs. 150 million? Is, is it too much? Wait, wait, wait. Let me get this. Tobenna, you mean you spent a whooping sum of 150 million naira just on clubbing? Oh my goodness. No wonder they say a fool and his money will soon be parted. Excuse me? What did you say? Did you just call me a fool? I, Tobena, the man of war, did you just call me a fool? Tobena, you have to find the money and pay him off. Else you will lose your credibility in the eyes of the people of Umunono. I don't have such money and I can't search you this time. My husband, I came to say a big thank you to you for being an amazing husband, a wonderful father to his children, and a great king to our people of Omonono. May the gods continue to bless you. I can't pray for a better father. You are one in a million. <laughs> it is a pleasure hearing this from my wonderful wife and my very adorable son. I am indeed very glad, but I am feeling it in my spirit, from the depth of my heart, that there is more to this than what has been revealed to me. So I am soliciting, can somebody tell me what exactly is going on here? My husband, you are very correct. We are here to tell you that we support you in everything you do and that you can always count on us. I am glad. I am glad hearing that. You know, you are the very reason I smile each time I wake up in the morning. When I remember I have such a wonderful family, it gives me joy in my heart. Yes, just like you said, I can always count on you all. Thank you, my husband. My husband, we know you want Prince Sudoka to be the next king of Omon Ono Kingdom. Exactly, he's the next king. But we are begging you, please, for the sake of peace, give in to Tobenna. He can be the next king. What? For I am okay as the Prince of Omon Ono. I must not be a king. Yes, my husband. We are happy to be royalties. Prince Tobinna can be the next king of Fumunono. Yes, you know, a sheep in the harbor is safe because of the structures around the harbor, because of the security around the harbor. But is, is that where a sheep is supposed to be? I'm born in the harbor. No, what, what I'm trying to say is, are you finally giving in to this nonsense because you are scared or what? Why? Father, Father, we understand your plight. But we are not scared. Like my mother said, let us give peace a chance. Yes, my husband. Prince Tobena is still your son. He has his SSS, no doubt. But if you look at it very closely, he has been the one defending the dignity of the throne. And we feel he can be trusted with the same throne. Please, my husband. Defending 
the dignity of the throne. You actually feel he has been doing that? I can't believe they chickened out quickly. Mm -hmm. Cowards. That's what they are. Dala, dala. <laughs> now you, my brother, are going to become the next king of Umunono. And I cannot wait. <laughs> Me too. Mm -hmm. I cannot wait. We are going to rule this kingdom. And nobody, I mean nobody will be challenging us. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is Someone should go into the king's chamber mm -hmm. and get me the most expensive wine there. Mm -hmm. If the king asks who sent you, just say... Tell them that is the new king that sent you. Making sense. <laughs> <laughs> you are looking at the next king. Oh, yes, yes, sir. So, the king with the sauce. <laughs> the globalized king. <laughs> yes, so. Oh, God. Oh, Sunday, oh, Wendy. Oh, Sunday, oh, Wendy. Oh, Sunday, oh, Wendy. Your Majesty, now laws are the leader. I greet you. Christobena, I hope all is well. All is well, why do you ask? Because I can't remember the last time you came to this wing of the palace. I know you're surprised. Yes, I am. Relax, I come in peace. Don't forget I used to be the man of peace before you transformed me to the man of war. I am glad you are now a new creature. What do you mean by that? I heard what you told the king. I was touched. Yes, no doubt I was touched. Only a noble woman will do what you did. So I appreciate that. It's not in my day. I am glad you feel that way. Thank you very much. May the gods bless you with more wisdom. Amen. Thank you so much. Ijama, my beautiful sister. Ogum, <laughs> my I know you guys are all surprised, but relax. Some days are like that. Enuguuku, ne enuguuwo, abulugofu. We are one. <laughs> what just happened? This is unbelievable. I'm dazed. <laughs> In fact, I have absolutely nothing to say. Relax, women. A leopard can never change its spots. And what's that supposed to mean? Listen, in politics, sometimes you have to make your enemies friends just to know their next move. How? I had to make them feel safe. I had to make them feel comfortable so that they won't realize and throw them out of this kingdom the moment I become king. I see. Now I understand. Smart move. Don't forget, 
Salutation is not love. Do you understand? Yes, sir. <laughs> I wonder how some people lose their senses. Why not come here and say it? Just come over here and say it. Let me consume you like fire. No, she knows who that I put her. Hey, Machi. Majority of them children. For the youngest, the impact of the healthcare crisis. You won't believe what I just heard. Eight children, all under the age of five, died in. What is that? The king has decided to make Tobena his successor. Are you sure of all this? Very sure, Father. As a matter of fact, he was reported to have personally called the President General of Umunon, a progressive union, to say what he has decided. Oh, Father, this is not looking good. This is not good for us at all. <sighs> so the king would rather allow someone like Prince Tobena to rule this kingdom instead of uh, uh, kingship to rotate. I told you, Father. I told you you can never be too sure. Now it has happened. <sighs> when the rhythm of the drum changes, the dancers will change their dance steps also. Oh, Father. This is no time for proverbs. The question is, what do we do? Ago will be useful for us now. He will have to take the documents to the press. <laughs> How come I never thought about that? It's because two heads are better than one. You can say that again, Dad. Um, my king, our people say that a pre-announced war had takes the crippled by chance. Uh, we are here to hear your decision on who becomes the next king of Umunono. Well, mm -hmm. elders of Umunono, I want to thank you for your support. Thank, thank you, your, your majesty. majesty. But as you know, I have two sons. Udoka and the Tobenna, both princes of Umunona Kingdom. But as a way to solve the problem, as a way going forward, Prince Udoka has given his blessings to Prince Tobenna to emerge the next king of Umunona Kingdom. And that is to say, he is going to become Eze Osakwe the 16th of Umunona Kingdom someday. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice decision, I'm all saying. Um, so we now have Prince Tobena as the heir to the throne of Umunono. <laughs> the self acclaimed uh, man of war. <laughs> uh, my Prime Minister. Add little respect to my name. You just heard it from the horse's mouth that I will become Ezra Sakwe the 16th. So I am not self acclaimed man of war. Kishako Sukita. Enuguku. Enugungo. Aburofu. This is a huge step. We will watch Prince Tobina to know if he is fit to be our king. If found worthy to be the next king, the necessary rituals will be carried out. And his waiting commences till our king joins his ancestors. When I become king, men will be my cook, women will be my guard. 
something new must emerge. Who are you and how did you walk past my security? Standing before you is something mightier than security structures fixed by men. Nanya, I do not if a beard gang. You are standing before the next king of this land. So show some respect before you get me angry. And what makes you think that a fool like you will rule in Umnon? Me? How dare you? Did you just call me Prince Tobena, the man of war, a fool in my palace? I will show you that Tenuguku, Tenugungu, a brofu. My friend, wake up, leave this place. You're a witch. You think I don't know? You want to try me? What are you talking about? I say, leave this place. Leave this place. Leave. Just go. Me, a witch? Yes, you're a witch. So you want to attack me in my dream? You think I want to know? Leave this place first. I'm going to death. Say, Papa. Leave this place. Leave this place. Where do you want me to go by this time of the night? Leave this place. What about this voice? Witch. Say, Papa. What a witch. Can you imagine? So they sent you. They sent you. Tell them I am not available. How dare you? Leave this place. Leave this place also. Come, my friend, get out of this place. You're too small. Tell them you did not see me. Tell them you did not see me. I say get out before I strangle you to, to death. Can you imagine? Please, it's late. I can't go back now. Please, if you there, if I get you there, I will strangle you to death. Leave my house. Yeah? How will I live here this night? Oh God, please help me. I was with Prince Tobina when he woke me up and called me a witch and said I should leave his room before he kills me. And what did you do to him, if I may ask? Nothing. We were good before we slept. He just woke up and called me a witch and said I should leave his room. It was at the work where I dressed up. This is ridiculous. You are lucky that I am awake. I couldn't sleep. I decided to come out to clear my head. I'm sorry for this. I couldn't leave. It was late and I'm scared. Uh, don't, don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, you, you take it to the guest room. You'll be sleep there. Okay? Thank you, my prince. Thank you. You're so kind. I sent you out of this palace last night. What are you still doing around here? Were are you sent to kill me? Who are you to fix your mouth where it does not belong? Tobina, how evil can you be? 
You left this girl at the middle of the night in cold. What were you thinking? You left her in the cold. No. Huh? I don't want them. I left her in the cold. Onyoma see why you now carried her, pampered her into your room and made love to her. Yeah? You took my girlfriend in. Yeah. Now you have the ghost challenge me. What happened? I'm not walking up here. I'm stupid. Are you mad? I started the guest room. Who asked you to talk? You don't talk until you are asked to. Leave that girl alone. Everybody cannot be as useless as you. Huh? Why do you keep bringing shame upon this family? What is wrong with you? You are shameless. Yes, you are shameless because you took in my girlfriend, made love to her, yet you have the audacity to blab before me. I'm off you. Hey! I will destroy your face. Hey! 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 because of what happened earlier. I would have reacted differently. But because we are trying to become one big family, I would totally ignore it. Thank you for your understanding, my queen. And one more thing. I want you to speak to your son. Tell him to respect my king, the future king of this land. My son, let me tell you, he is no longer the small boy he used to know. He's now grown. He deserves some respect from him. Okay? That won't be a problem, my friend. I'll talk to my children. Prince Tobin, now we have to earn our respect. If not, that will be a very big problem. Um, please, ignore her. I'll talk to them. I promise. You better do that. The last but not the least, on the day of the pronouncement, your daughters and the maids will be the ones to serve the food. I mean, there is no need wasting money engaging ushers since we have girls that can do the job. Did I make myself clear? Yes, ma'am. I don't understand you. See, make I just tell you. Not be all this rubbish with the patayan. I know they see you. I know they see Una. I know they see your son. As a matter of fact, eh, Una, they invincible for where I day. You they hear me? If you like, make your son be the king of heaven. He not consign me. You they hear me so? Which kind of nonsense be that? Oh, no worry yourself. She be you want me to serve food, eh? Not me food. We go serve him. We go serve the food. Listen to me. Be very careful. Are you hearing me? Be very careful. I beg, come on, for my face. Which kind of nonsense be that? See, if they do that rubbish way, they do the draw with your children, oh. Make it just a draw with your children. Don't just try them with me because ah, I will give you back to back. However you want it. No, did you see that? Like did you see that? Mm. Her. Don't worry. Oh, did you hear that? Relax. We will serve the food. Mommy, don't talk like that. We will serve the food. The drama. Which kind of insult be the drama? Do you want to kill me? You know I don't have anybody. Mommy, wait till they talk. What do you mean you don't get anybody? No, they worry yourself. Only me in a full community. I didn't give one for grand. Anyhow, what they want, I go give them. What's the meaning of that now? No, they worry yourself. They want me to serve food, Abby. You go serve them now. She is strong and she is Like a lion, she is bold. We should serve the food. Ah, what nonsense. 
This disrespect is becoming way too much for me to bear. We serve food. So if we were gentle as our mother, these people would have treated us like trash. That we should serve food. They could not use us to eat and grind now. <laughs> but they can't, obviously. Serve food and you idiots. You good for nothing idiots had the guts to insult my mother. The mother to the future king of Umunon. Are you crazy? You are the one who have lost your sense of time. You are ready mad. For you to come here to talk to my sister and I, you are crazy. I don't have time for you fools. When you're done talking, you leave. Oh, will you shut up before I forget my hand on your face? You'll not be forget them now. When are they here? <laughs> you yes. fit? You fit? I just don't understand what's going on here. Like, you guys have the courts. What insolence? Like, are you both crazy? Or have you gone banana? Not the only banana, my sister. I go soon send you to Plantain Island. What? Idiots. Fool. Yeah, big fools. Live here. Live here. You know why I'll let this slide? Because I know say it is Benona. Say my brother, the man of war, is the future king of Umunono. Yes, sir. It is Benona be. He go soon begin the tatashiona. He go the pepe on In the kingdom of the blind, the one-eyed man is the leader. I am not surprised. Hey, 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 hey. You this overgrown chicken, listen to me. The next time you hear me cough or talk, you shut I beg you shut your own mouth. Something they worry for head. I'll be the planner for you. Which kind of rubbish be that? Okay, it's fine. Let's wait and see how long your so-called future king will stay on the throne without exhibiting his madness as the mad dog that he is. Yeah, let's wait. Will. Let's wait. You, you're laughing. You, you're the one that is blind. You are a fool, idiot. You know what? Your family members, why am I stopping there? Your generations, they are all monkeys, idiots. Leave, leave. What are you still waiting for? You both are mad! Morgan, never! Who do you think you are? Try me. Who do you think you are? Agu, this whole thing never changed. We only changed the strategy. Isn't it? You expect an Odogu like me. Tika na Ogunanya to trust you after Toying and praying with me? Come on, Agu. We've taken out Prince Udoka from the picture. Now use the information you have to take out Prince Dobina and everyone would be happy. Just like that? Just like that. I mean, you've always wanted to do this, haven't you? So tell me, what is my reward? Really, Agu? Are we going to talk about that right now? Of course. <laughs> of course, why not? You see, you must not separate an intelligent man from his money. I am a man with national reputation. I don't do business that does not bring profit. But other Baba. Very well then. Everyone who participates in this will be rewarded. I mean, if you don't become the king, you will at least have a title. A very big one at that. Interesting. I will hold you by your word. But if you joke with me, if you mess with me, you can go and ask questions about me. I don't remember. Eh? I will finish you. Which implies we have a deal. Oh, we have a deal. No good deal. Yes, we have a deal. We will destroy place to Benna. Oh? I like the sound of that. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Oh, don't mention. <laughs> no. <laughs> you're welcome. Hey, that's a woman. No, no. This is indeed an enlarged meeting. And as you can see, all the members of my family are here as you requested. 
and uh, they will be very delighted to hear what you want to say. Yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, you will not claim you have not heard the news making the rounds. Your Majesty, to put it mildly, Priest Tobena is a heartless criminal that embezzled 150 million naira belonging to Umunono Kingdom. Bioga, watch what you say. I am not a criminal. Enugu, 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 approve. Priest Tobena, you are not in the position to correct me. For your information, we have taken a decision and our decision is irrevocable. And if I may ask you, no, what decision have you taken as men in council? Please, I want the men in council to speak like men. Go straight to the point. Your Majesty, we are here to talk about the future of this kingdom. And that future is connected to knowing who succeeds the king. Since none of your sons is fit, we have decided that royalty must rotate. Royalty must do what? Rotate. Royalty must rotate. I remember I once told you that when the moon is shining, even the cripple becomes hungry for a walk. It is obvious that all of you men in council, you all want to be king. That means you have actually forgotten what my ancestor did to deserve the throne, right? Your Majesty, I do not want to be king. All I want is a peaceful Omunono, where our children will not have any abomination hanging on their necks. What abomination are you talking about? Where was your forefather when my forefather risked his own life for this land? Today, everywhere is peaceful. The young ones are no longer dying in their numbers. People now go about their legitimate businesses unhindered. And now, you all believe that you have what it takes to cause royalty to leave from this family. Let me tell you something. You heard as a castle. What you are saying may happen every other place, but it will never happen here in Omonona Kingdom. Your Majesty, all we want is the betterment of this community, and nothing more. Betterment of the community, and nothing more. Do you actually think I don't know of the game you have been playing? You been in council? No, you really think I don't know of your secret meetings? Your gang up against royalty? You think I don't know? Your Majesty. Okwanaba, Mama Mahapu Hele Wedobo. Yes, it is the jaw that intentionally allowed itself to be stretched by your name. I was playing along all this while. Yes. I was just playing along because I wanted to get to the root of the matter. For I know that if I counter them or maybe ask too many questions, they will actually exclude me from their plans. That is what I'm doing. So, what have they been up to? Um, Your Majesty, the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister and some chiefs are actually working hard on moving this throne out of this family. But I, I considered our closeness, how good you have been to me, and I decided not to allow it to happen. Yes. So, what are they going to rely on to achieve that very stupid objective? What else are they going to rely on than that same matter, that same topic, that your wife does not have a background, Rather, she is coming from an unknown background. So, why do we have people that are parading themselves as men 
whereas they are not men. I married that woman appropriately. I'm aware. No. In line with the marital laws of Umunono Kingdom. The family from where I married her, they have not come forward to say I didn't marry one of their own. I have named her my wife. And she has been functioning in that capacity as wife to the king. Why are those men raising dust concerning her? Why? But I think it is not important now. It is so irrelevant. I want to suggest to you, why not play along with me for now? Let us just play along so that we can take them on our ways. Let us destabilize them. Make it impossible for them to devise another means of fighting you. I knew all that. I knew everything going on. I simply allowed to Bernard to take that fall because he deserves to take that fall to correct himself. But I want to make a very specific statement right here and right now. Prince Udoka is the crown prince of this kingdom. And should I join my ancestors? He is the one that must emerge, the next king of this land. Father, Your Majesty, that is impossible. Never. Never. He can never, never. rule us. He is an incomplete man. He has no maternal history. So as a person is a complete man, I can never rule this kingdom. Well, listen, I don't want us to go into unnecessary arguments. There is a very simple, ancient way to solve this problem. Just wait for me. <coughs> my elders, over my dead body will Prince Udoka rule over me. His mother was not married legitimately, so that is the law. Hana Chaoko, he cannot rule over me. Yes, he's illegal. He's an immigrant. I am sure most of you have not even seen this before. This is that ancient sword. The very weapon that killed that useless Dioba. Who killed his wife and married his daughter and started that abomination that almost crippled Umunana. Before Osakwe, my ancestor, took the bull by the horn and they ended him with this very sword. This very sword here is that authority that empowers kings in Omonona. Handed down from generation to generation of all the kings that ever ruled in this land from Osakwe family. Now, if you were that fear that you have what it takes to cause royalty to depart from Mustaque family, to any family you are trying to present, I want your leader, who is your know, who, to lift this sword and make specific statements. And when that is done, we are going to leave this in the hands of the gods. Bezin spoke to his loyal highness. You know I am allergic to Lisk. I don't have a very big gain at all. When I do business, I cash out. You gotta go talk to him. This thing is becoming, uh, is taking a different dimension. Okay, no, 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 They won't have Will you shut up and stop speaking rubbish for once? Agu. Agu. This is not the time for your nonsense. You schemer. Just keep quiet. We've come too far and this is a deciding moment. Not a time to return. Do not provoke me right now. Rubbish. Men in council. No, no. 
and all members of royal family. There is a reason we are men in council this time, and that is to guard the actions of the king. A child of a slave can be king in all places. It cannot happen in Umnol. Good, because it's illegal. Uriraduro. Udoka here is that a young man who has no maternal home. Uriraduro. Ndebai. Okwas no socho mad. Obana ikunne. When a man runs into troubled waters, he will always find peace in his maternal home. If we allow him to be king, it will amount to an abomination. Our children will have a king that will be lost. Therefore, he is disqualified to be our king. And that is the decision of the men in council. And so must it be. An immigrant can never be a king. Well spoken, Odo. Well delivered. Truth is bitter. Oh no, who? He will Oh no, who? Dana, child, what are immigrants? you to know that nobody hurts you. Nobody denies you anything. You are the person who allowed that thought to rise in your head in the first place. And I want to believe that what happened here today will be able to make you understand that we can war, we can fight over everything. We cannot fight over the truth. But if you feel that it is your right to march the next king after me, if you feel that somebody is actually denying you that right, I want you to lift this sword right before us, and then we will know whether we have been right or wrong all this while. The king is talking to you. Interested. Hmm? And no longer will you fight for something that is not yours. Udoka, it has always been you. We needed a day such as this to make people understand that. Lift this sword. Don't worry, he will fall. He will fall. That's <laughs> 
もいいし。ものを食いたい。The coming king of whom none can doubt. King of our kingdom. <laughs> she is strong and she is brave. Like a lion, she is bold and fear no man. She fears no man. She's a woman of peace, but knows how to fight. No one challenges her and goes cut free. Hey, she's a warrior. She's a warrior. She always go on fire for fire and battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace. But she always go on fire for fire. And battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace. She fears no man at all. Hey, she fears no man at all. Whoa, she fears no man at all. Yeah. She fed no man at all. Oh yeah. She is strong and she is brave. Like a lion, she is bold and fear no man. She fears no man. She's a woman of peace, but knows how to fight. No one challenges her and goes cut free. Hey, she's a warrior. She's a warrior. She always go on fire for fire and battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace. But she always go on fire for fire and battle for battle. If you want peace, she can give you peace. She fears no man at all. Hey, she fears no man at all. Whoa, she fears no man at all. Yeah, she fears no man at all. Oh yeah. Champion, yeah, Rosa. She na you invent the formula. We make everybody the grace. She na you design the strategy. We make everybody the man. Yeah. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting own madness. So I, so why you dey show yourself? I be we go run for you. So why you dey show yourself? Oh? Two people know the place at a time. Oh, we stop this madness. Let us live as family. Ijo. Stop this madness. Let us live in peace. Yo, brother, stop this madness. Let us live as family. Ijo. I stop this madness. Let us live in peace. Yo, I. You say you be my. But we never hear say you don't fight before. If you enter for house, you go show us muscle. If you enter for house, you go give us trouble. I've been a your baby that dropping trouble like food. I've been a your baby that one day one trouble. Oh, oh. when I you invent the formula. We make everybody the grace. She na you design the strategy. We make everybody the man. Yeah. Remember, say every man I'm getting ghetto. Now so everybody getting own madness. So I, so why you dey show yourself? 
I'll be we go on for you. So why you they show yourself? Oh? Two people know the grace at a time. Oh. Stop this madness, let us live as family. Stop this madness, let us live in peace. Yo. Brother, stop this madness, let us live as family. I stop this madness, let us live in peace. Yo. I you say you be man of war. Yeah. But we never hear say you don't fight before. If you enter for house, you go show us muscle. If you enter for house, you go, you go give us trouble. I've been a your baby that drop in trouble like food. I've been a your baby that one day one trouble. Oh.